Alright, this is going to be a very, very curious stream because I don't know why I have not been having the greatest of night sleeps and I'm like feeling a little bit of the tiredness, but I feel like if I dive into it, I'll be like, yeah, yeah, you know, you know what I mean? It's like a coffee. It's like a pick me up. Three, two, one. Hello, everybody. Welcome to the stream. It is the BNR stream today on this fine 17th of June 2024. I hope you're having a wonderful week and we'll have a wonderful there. We'll have a wonderful week ahead of you. I almost got there. Um, but yeah, no, my week has been pretty all right. Tired, definitely feeling it, but I don't know. I can, I can definitely power through this one. And you know what? We're going to, we're going to run fast. We're going to, uh, uh, run red, uh, uh, Mirror's Edge. <laughs> Mirror's Edge! Um, Mirror's Edge is an interesting game because it's one that- I might as well- hold on, let's see if I can jump to it. And then it's gonna be a very, very, like, quick go because I got the launcher. Here it comes, ready? Here it comes. We're, go we're probably gonna have to do some audio balance. Are we good? Oh, I've got the Steam overlay! Oh! People are gonna know who my friends are. Oh, that'll be fun. Maybe let's disable that. <laughs> um, but yeah, no, this is Mirror's Edge. Yeah, let's actually disable the Steam, the Steam friends. Hi, Steam uh, friends. Uh, just offline, just so the mates don't ping me in the middle of the stream. This is Mirror's Edge. Mirror's Edge is a game by Digital Illusion CE, otherwise known as DICE. Uh, they are famous for making, uh, the Battlefield games and, uh, sort of recently the Star Wars Battlefront games and famously Battlefield 2042, where I don't know if we've really heard of much of them. This was from that wonderful era of video games when, as a company, you can sort of have, like, one of these smaller ideas somehow get formed into some game. This game isn't really too much of a full game. In fact, to some degree, I think it is very, very short. We're probably going to try and play for the whole thing today on stream so this will be fun oh i can see my friends oh i can't see my friends there's no online on this game there's also no online on the sequel uh they've taken down the um the the rankings the ratings so let's have a normal game on normal uh hard is basically just it, it hides the hints and it's a nice pro mode but in terms of telling you about the um the city used to pulse with energy yo yeah this is a yo moment <laughs> I think I first played this game maybe back in like 2013 or 2014. It was definitely... <laughs> I do love me. Not so humble flex. I have a speed run. Ooh! Very nice. Very nice. I have... I think I've played this game a, a couple of times around 2014, 2013. And I haven't played it for like 10 years. So the only thing I've really gotten back to getting used to this game is that I've seen other people play it. And I've played the first two levels as a prep. The mirror's edge. The mirror's edge. Oh, sorry, you got you got to say it in like an ASMR vibe. You got to be like, the mirror's edge. <laughs> Just bump the mic. It. I I do believe this hasn't aged really that much for 2009 games. And it, the flow. The flow. Yes. <laughs> um, I know 2009 isn't that long ago. It's only 15 years. Um, where are my subtitles? Did I not have subtitles turned on? Hold on, because I know people are going to, like, cry if I don't have subtitles. Yeah, what the heck? Who turned them off? Who turned off the subtitles? Because I'm going to talk over this stuff. Uh, so we start off with the tutorial level. This will, will be pretty pretty smooth for me to talk okay. over um but basically how you play the game is you jump with left button i'm gonna play with this with a controller by the way just to just because um stick movement i think is a little bit nicer for a visual than you know <laughs> this all the time um we got left trigger to crouch left button to jump you got an objective screen that i'll try to not look at and other than that away you go uh but yeah this game it's fairly unique. There's not really another, like, game of its kind of, you know, budget that really does tick these boxes like this. Although certainly newer games have maybe tried to add in more and more parkour elements that this game 
uh, popularized, maybe? I don't know. It probably existed in other games around this, you know, around this time as well. But it's a game that's all about it. One thing I actually really like about this game as well that r really makes the uh, presentation hold up is not the uh, the very blocky Unreal Engine 3 fonts used on screen, uh, but rather the, um, the, m the animations are, like, remarkably good. They don't look, like, too jank for video gamey. Uh, whoops. <laughs> whoops. <laughs> Whoopsies. Um, but you see what I mean, where it's like, you know, this character is moving around quite freely. They're, you know... We're gonna bonk this door. She's going alright. You know, that there's a bit of Zed fighting going on with the door frame on my right. Oh, whoops. Um... But, yeah. And the other thing that I think really stands out about this game, obviously, is the, uh, the color palette. Obviously, there's the buildings and the sky are very... Well, the sky is pretty blue, but, like, the buildings are incredibly monotone white. Which makes any sort of highlight wall or railing or <laughs> any of these, like, primary color objects really stands out. And on top of that, anything that highlights red, this is a gameplay hint. It's to tell you that, yes, you can run and jump towards that red thing. It's probably important. Oops. <laughs> I was just way off on the side. Whoops. Have I have I mentioned that it's been like maybe a decade since I played this one? I played the I played it before they sort of stealth announced and then oh my gosh, excuse me. Before they stealth announced and release. Beautiful looking for sure. Yeah, the the bloom is sort of insane. That's the only catch. Which is it's very, you know, Xbox 360 generation for this. Alright. Oh. Whoa. Yeah, sure, that works. I have no idea if landing on the pipe like that is bad for you. Anytime I see a blurring, I assume I've not done it quite right, but I never quite get the, you know, the blurring well, so. Although landing on those, like, you know, poles that are j pipes are just right on the wall. Um, but yeah, no, the bloom is sort of insane. The depth of field or the blurring, mm, it's okay. I can get used to it. Uh, you'll sometimes get these more complex, like, or I guess compound kinds of structures here, where this one you've got to run across the wall, and then j run and jump and grab the ledge. We've got a right button, which will let you do a quick 180, or sometimes a 90 degree, depending on what you're doing. You can also do a shimmy here. Um, a lot of this is very contextual, and you also always feel that, yeah, the levels are generally designed around playing them one way. Red color on the screen indicates pain. Oh, true. I mean, oh, she, you got a glove on one hand. I feel like that would... Oh, the drop is insane. International shipping. Ship yourself to the internations. And then you try to drop... <laughs> Cutting that one a bit fine. Um... We've got these ones as well, where you want to try and tuck yourself in, in the air, so you're not landing on spikes. And, you can do a roll, like it's Zelda. And you can, nope. <laughs> this is what I get for being slightly off. Uh, landing is a bit difficult. It is, yeah. This game isn't too punishing, though. Uh, it auto saves very, very frequently. I also always seem to just completely avoid that there's that up there. And you can either jump, or you can just, you know, well... Yeah, nah. <laughs> just jump. We'll just... Well, let's not be fancy. Uh, the last bit of gameplay that they really want to teach you is uh, a bit of weapons training. Merc wants me to run you through some sparring. And you know fighting. But your, your weapons are your fists! Okay, come on. Her angry face. So you can punch people, just like you punched that door earlier. You can crouch and punch people in the boob. <laughs> okay. You can do this uh, jump kick. And you can do a slide kick. Depending on how you're doing, uh, this will do all right. Let's run through some weapon disarms. Also, I guess as an Unreal Engine game, and especially by people who make a shooter franchise, uh, there is a little bit of gunplay. Uh, it is your choice whether you want to grab the gun and then, you know, pew, 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 pew. But you don't get told how many bullets are in it, and you only get like seven usually. Nice swing. Bonk. Bonk on the head. And uh, the last one is there is a slow mo mode if you suck at doing that bonk on the head. <laughs> now, obviously, it's like, you know, Xbox 360 graphics, you know, hair isn't as 
crazy detailed as it is now. It sort of looks like a very okay, painted wig. Get but I don't know, like I think the shadows and the the models it all works and looks fairly alright. I don't know. I think it's it's pretty alright. So let's play the game. Let's get into the game. Uh the game consists of ten levels. Uh each level starts off with a uh little bit of a painted cutscene. Although I think this uh this level starts off pretty alright. This is sort of your, uh, you know, your artsy beginning. I do really like this game. Uh, is it perfect? No. And we'll probably experience some of those imperfections as we go along. But it's neat for what it is. Did they charge full price for this at the time, though? I think I'd be a little bit, like, hard sold. Maybe that's why reviewers might have, like, not liked it. Because they're like, eh, you know, it's a bit short for what it is. There's a side jump feature. When you do a side jump and immediately look towards the direction you dash, your momentum will immediately build up to 100%. Is that something you can do with a controller? This is playing by itself, by the way. I'm not doing this, but... It's cool. Like, can you can you look to the side very easily? PC pleb? Oh, I mean, I'm on PC. I, I It's just that I, I like the idea of a controller for... Um, just having some smoother camera for... A let's play. Yeah, yeah, a playthrough. But, but yeah, now we got some free running. And you can see that there's quite a lot of, like, you know, choices, I guess. Uh, very quick choices, but it's just like, you know, the objects are not... Sorry, the, the highlighted object is actually sort of far away. And you get a bit of a choice on what you want to do. Like, for example, you know, they could highlight the fence there, but it's like, why would I want to do the fence? You could actually... Oh, can you actually grab that pole? I'm actually curious. I'm not going to stop and run around too much, but... Not really. Okay. <laughs> now it's probably over here. True. So, hold on. If you do that, you do, like... What do you do? You do... You do that, right? Ouch. So, it's like, you got you got your mouse, you do a... That. Sort of like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. That makes sense. Whereas, I guess on a controller, it's like... It's like, here I am. Mm, you, can, you can lean into it, but I don't know if you could leverage it as fully as a mouse. Uh, also, apolo apologies for motion- Oh! I broke my legs on the first pipe. Uh, apologies for motion sickness, by the way, because the whole game's in first person and is played with a bit of a- A bit of an FOV that I think a lot of people probably mod to be a bit higher on PC. But yeah, you play as uh, as Faye, she's a runner, she runs, and she delivers bags. The bags are probably a bit, you know, if I if I say contraband, it's not necessarily like drugs and bad stuff, but it's more just, you know, the things that they don't want you to see. Uh, the game's also going to tell me about these icons. Uh, these icons, if you ever see them, just means that there's a, a, hidden, a hidden bag somewhere that might be, well, it definitely will be around, but it's, uh, it means that there uh, may be some, you know, bonus goodie. You can unlock a cool little thing. They've just... Yeah, here we go. They <laughs> flat out give you one here. Every level has three, I think. They look like a sidestep boost work, though. Nah, it's all good. It's all good. I do like showing a bit more than, like, a typical player sees. Like, even though it's casual, I always like showing fun stuff. I've got, like, glitch showcase streams and things like that. Now, obviously, yes, it's like they taught you about guns. You're going to start encountering people who uh, sort of are going to chase after you. And they're going to try and shoot at you. Uh, Faye has, uh, you know, healing capabilities. Uh, I remember that there's another uh, case up here. There we go. They might be... Hi there. <laughs> but don't worry about taking too much damage because you heal, you know over time. Which works in a game like this, because you're not stopping around for health packs. We're gonna need to get the heck out of dodge, though. You st again, lots of different choices to get across the buildings. It does, you know, like guiding you away, but, uh... But, uh, yeah. Now, not everyone you can exactly fight. Sorry, you can run past- I just kicked that guy in the nuts. Poor guy. You okay? I'm gonna take your gun. Now you could be that kind of guy who's like, doo, 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 doo. 
You could be that kind of guy. Uh, also, I'm gonna accidentally hit X sometimes with hit the slow-mo. I'm gonna try and avoid that one. Because I'm good enough. I don't need no slow-mo mode. <laughs> I got there. I got it. It's all good. Don't worry. Get to Celeste. There are more blues on the way. Hello. It's a pretty good throw. <laughs> Woo. Okay, I got it from here. Okay. I mean, she's trained. Playing she's trained. I'll be fine. Get out of here. Get out of here. Nope. Hi there. See ya. <laughs> Be like the kind of what's the what's the one um Leslie Jones like movie, and it's just like the guy like takes the worst routes to like run away from things. Anyway, we hit the helicopter and uh, we got this wonderful bit of cinematic to end everything off with. I mean, I would have complained if the game called Mirrors Edge didn't have working mirrors. See ya. Did I say fate? I said Faith, not Faith. I did not say Faith. There's a Faith in the in the stories today. And I was just like, oh no, I actually said Faith, oh no. It's close. Have I mentioned it's been a decade since I last played this? <laughs> so that's our first level. We're making good progress, good time. We'll see how well we go, but I, yeah, no, I'm I'm totally expecting this is all done in like one stream. Uh what I do want to open up is a potential later on for a blind playthrough of the sequel because I know nothing about it other than it's open world. Robert Pope, taking a statement on that break-in last week. Anyways, it's a 56 West Arlington. Enhance. Copy that. I'll relay the message, Officer Connors. Thanks. Connors out. Dude, she's got the same, the same posture I have when I stream. You know me. Try and get some sleep. Legs up, lean forward. Put the word out tomorrow. It's the future. You've got to have all these wonderful 4x3 okay. monitors. I like the top and matured. matured. Yeah, I know. See you, Merc. Shots fired. Repeat, shots fired. All units proceed to 56 West Arlen Drive immediately. Proceed with caution. Kate! Oh no, the cards! Locked and mixed feelings about, but. Yeah, I feel like I, I'm always a bit mixed on open worlds, but on the flip side, I also wouldn't necessarily hate it. Like I don't know. Merc, you off? Just get on comms and track me. And she's gone. Despite it looking like nighttime, it's uh. Well, I guess it's 5:20 a.m. So. My sister. Uh, okay, I'm gonna see if I can figure out what's going on. Give me a sec. Well, away we go. Level two. It's more of the same, but every level takes you into different places, and you'll have different kinds of jumps to to go through. Generally, this game doesn't really have enough time to just introduce more mechanics every level, though. So it's mostly just different set pieces. Well, yeah, no, it's great fun. I enjoy this game a ton. <laughs> Dang it. I should have done like this kind of... <laughs> Something around there. Oh, I'm slipping. I'm running all over the place. This game, I mean, this game is a natural like speedrunner stream. I was not running up for that one. That... There we go. It's terrifying when you jump off. Oh my gosh. I gotta run all the way there again. Let's just say I'm sloppy. I'll get there though. I'll get there. Don't worry. <laughs> There's some real like professional runners of this game, so. Oh yeah, yeah. Tell a tell an audio designer what does dying feel like, and they'll just give you the most like terrifying thing ever. This is the. Yeah, kind of, almost works. I don't know. What does that say? Oh. It says dice on the side of the aircon. There you go. You know, we were running away, right? Finally, someone who could actually make a difference in this place. Ah, oh, someone running 
for mayor that can do something about it. I love this green room as well. Looks like a ramp jump, but it wasn't. I'm too smart. Uh, maybe. <laughs> maybe. I haven't overthought this. I'm just kind of, you know, taking it as it comes. I love this flavor text as well in the lifts. For example, avian flu. Oh, that's a bit topical, isn't it? Am I going to get demonetized because I'm mentioning avian flu? This was around the time that, like, there was the last bird flu anyways. You know what I mean? Because then there was that, and then there was, like, whooping cough, and then there was swine flu, and then there was Ebola. You know what I mean? Like, there's always a flu. There's always a thing. Oh, hi there. That, that, that's me while streaming. I'm just napping at my desk. What are you doing here? What happened? Did you? No. You don't recognize him? Sure. Uh. It's Robert. Robert Pope? Friend of Dad's? Shit. That Pope. He called me. We hadn't talked much since I joined up. He had Man, it's not the time week. to be sleeping He's at your desk. Campaigner. Don't you read the news? It's not news anymore. I, I don't think it's like paying attention. It might actually be like... Um, so the break -in must have really I don't know, some of it is like, you know, I, 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 I play at 4K, I've, I've like spot the stuff in motion. I don't know. Really? I haven't seen him for at least 10 years. Anyway, he was alive when I got here. Just sitting at his desk, writing. Everything went black. When I came to, he'd been shot. Everything went black? And I'm pretty sure it's with my gun. That sounds a bit a guilty. Desk, a diary. It was gone. I'm sure there was someone else in the building. Left my radio in the car. Haven't had time to phone it in. Why you Come leave it? Ah. Oh. I'll take you somewhere safe. This isn't. Oh, you got evidence on a hand. Like they could Why DNA you match you. Guilty. You think this was an accident, Kate? There are no accidents in this city. Someone wanted you. Oh, that mirror in the back. Wanted you. A window in the, the back. Oh no. Me. Effie, please. You've got contacts. There's got to be more to this. Something he knew. Something he wanted to tell Well, he me. was running for government. In this, Kate. You know what I do. I just. What was it? Uh, was it um Mexico City? You see that one story of like I'll see what I can do. They they like did the like elections just recently. And it was like 57 57 candidates were assassinated along the way. Like wow. If you if you're if you're in Mexico, oh my gosh, man. I don't I would never <laughs> I know that's a it's a crazy stat, which is one more than the last mid-election cycle, like, two years before. And it's just, like, continually getting higher and higher. It's very, very, like, surreal and strange. Shit. Oh, hi there. Hi. The building, you just chilling in there? Okay. See ya. Woo! <laughs> breaking records, yeah. <laughs> well, speaking of breaking records, let's get the... Oh, hi there. And it's a SWAT as well. Oh, no. So I'm pretty sure you can like look at this and go, ooh, stairs, but if you're really thinking about it, it's like, ooh, steps. You can even do like a wall run for no real reason. That makes me think that it's a it's a lift, but no, it's like, no, it's off limits. You can't access it. Oh, the soundtrack is great as well. Eh. Uh, it's probably better. Oh, that was literally a staircase. <laughs> oh, wait, that's glass. Oh no, I got glassed. <laughs> because you meant to go over here. Oh my god. Okay, sorry guys. Sorry, I'm taking the slow route. <laughs> yeah, the bloom's a bit insane. Like, oh, white wall. Uh, this room, I also always, like, second guess myself. I'm sorry. Oh. <laughs> I'm on the floor. I'm on the floor. Hold on. There we go. I don't think there's any like extra goodies up there, so let's go in the in the vent. We're venting. It's a bit sus. What year is it? 2017. I'm trying to get like into the, like what what the kids are into. Like I'm like borderline Gen Z, but not enough. Oh my gosh, not enough that like I know all the all the memes, all the brain rot stuff. Fate's about to. <laughs> yeah. Exactly. I love action movies with these like angled glass sliding buildings. You know what I mean? It's like a Jackie Chan movie probably has this. In, like rush hour or something like that. Also helicopter shooting at you. It's great. I love it. 
Uh, you just gotta have a bit of faith. There we go. Almost out of there. Jump down here. Slide a bit. I love the sign saying, we are family. That's Is that a bunch of models? It actually might be. Moving! I'm literally falling due to gravity. What do you mean move? I'm getting there. Oh, we got the icon. Can you tell where the, the hidden goodie is? It's probably back here. There it is. Although clearly I didn't pick up all of them in the first level, so... Uh, I probably want to go that way. Woo! I was, I was about to say, it's not a good shot, but then he hit me at the end. Ah. Didn't quite do my wall ride the best. Whoops. There we go. That's how you do it. It's the future. They got lots of solar panels. I know there's a door there. I'm just like, I have no idea where they hide all the goodies. Yep, definitely hit that. Ah, my butt. <laughs> Oh, hi there. Yeah, I don't know, it's a sign of getting old once you stop understanding what, like, the youth are into. And, like, <laughs> good meme. Bonk. The hourly new- <laughs> this, this, this door, the quick turn is simple. Oh yeah, definitely. I think a lot of games really need, like, a quick turn as well on controller as well. Oh, I've slow mode the lift. A lot of games need a quick turn. We have a breaking story here at City Eye Channel News. Attorney and, and then you get a bit of time to sit and rest and watch you apparently running. I want to see me. We'll bring you regular updates on the story as they unfold. Ah, they can't even film me right. Help! I need tech support. I need tech support. I'm 24, so I'm kind of in between here. Any Rizgat skivity? 19 bucks for the for the Fortnite card. Oh. I broke my legs because I accidentally hit right button. Cash. <laughs> hey, at least I fixed the lift between uh between um checkpoint <laughs> loading. Um but Yeah, ah, uh, like I don't know if I fully get it. I will say one thing though, I'm so glad that like Gen Z just reinvented YouTube poops. It's like, that was my thing. I was into that, and they're into basically the same thing, so... Keck. <laughs> oh, down we go. This is like such a cool set piece moment as well. This whole thing's f filled with great set piece moments. Having like this Snowden Plaza, like that's a bit tongue in cheek, ain't it? Actually, that was before. That was a bit before he uh, did stuff, wasn't it? White Alice. Now that one is a bit, you know. You're five day in a can. Five, five a day. Ooh. There's signs for this guy. Look how insanely blue this place is. Like, oh my gosh. Look how insanely pink this YouTube poop culture in Finland. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, I mean, every, all younger generations love surrealism. And it's just like, that is like the form of surrealism that like people like knew how they could do. Is there a thing up there? Makes it look like it's up there, but oh well. Look at these little street sweepers and Zed fighting objects. Oh, there's a guy. Let's get him! Oh. Oops. <laughs> yeah, good enough. They don't take too many hits, so... Uh. Oh! That NVIDIA physics! Oh, I want to give it another go. Yeah! <laughs> There's a... Oh, there was an auto. I love, like, sliding under the, um, the gates of the closing. That feels nice and dramatic. I'm like hopping off this step here to get up onto this bridge. I 
There's a lot of cool things. Is Krieg in his name or Krieg in his name? I love these streets because you never quite go to the streets. Sliding down again and ooh. Ouch. Oh, my butt. <laughs> Dude, this guy looks straight from Mark Echo getting up, man. Is that her name? <laughs> Don't worry about your sis, okay? We'll She's just built different, okay? <laughs> 7 a.m. waking up in the morning. It's his lair as well. Something's got somebody rattled, kiddo. I don't know what it is, but they're mighty jittery. I always love how different some people sound with certain kinds of microphones and compression. Nah, those blues can't move for shit. I've got a little gun happy though. Wires are fizzing about and then you like hear a friend over the phone. It's like, what is that really? You? <laughs> Don't know what's got into them. Must be contract renewal time. Be careful out there, Sal. So why all the heat? Now a girl's been lifting evidence from a crime scene. Now every cop in the city seems to be after her. That the evidence you lifted? Yeah, I think it's from a diary. <laughs> oh, so <laughs> you're admitting to it? Out our Icarus, maybe, and to the highest, Icarus. Wasn't he the Greek guy? Yeah, his dad made him some wings. <laughs> the Greek guy? Backs. Then the boy flew too close to the sun. And pss, no more wings, no more Icarus. If anyone's heard anything, then you know who Classic the Icarus. Yeah. I know he ain't a runner anymore, but he's got contacts. You can't avoid him. Does anyone unironically yeah. call, who? like, anything they want to yeah. succeed Icarus? That just seems like a death sentence. It's like naming, like... Your child Oedipus. It's like you don't do it. You're setting Great himself up for failure. He's on some rooftops of the old runner training ground near the storm drains. Roots crawling with blues though. You can follow the canal Man, to the all... town district. <laughs> you jumped in the most <laughs> fanciest of areas. We got some slower kinds of levels where you got a bit more a bit more swinging, a bit more jumping. <laughs> yeah, exactly. 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 Alright. Ooh. What's another name that's like, yeah, nah. There's definitely a bunch of modern examples, I'll tell you that. Make a run for it? Man. It's like I was trained to do this. Also, rat gaming hours. We got rats. Commence fire. Maybe she should, like, put her hair on a bun or something. Oh, hi there. There's a package somewhere here. Is it, like, right behind this wall? Nope. Where is it? There it is. <laughs> Hannibal. Hannibal's okay. Woo! <laughs> I jumped. He can't get me. I'm jumping. <laughs> The canals just keep going. Well, to check it out, I was like, ooh. Little side room over here. She does take a sweet time turning some valves sometimes, though. That does happen. But I do like how there's a good number of, like, alternate routes that you can take to get through areas. That seems cool. Perhaps it's something that's very, very well uh, designed in the sequel. I don't know. We'll see. Eventually. One day. <laughs> Sooner than later. Alright, where are we looking at? Ah, oh, this area. Yeah. Yeah. So I believe... Oh, what are you meant to do here? Ah, yeah. There's a big long setup. Eh. <laughs> okay. Cross we go. Woo! <laughs> oh. 
Who builds a pit just in the middle of a city? I would build this pit. Then you gotta do these like real sick wall running, wall running bits just to like safely get down each ledge. There's probably a bunch of ways that you could do this, but I like doing it like that. <laughs> Birds out. Looks like you're in the and actually fall with a big red plank. Ah, that that makes sense too. Uh, and then I'd always get up to this point, I'm like, huh. Wait. I'm gonna- oh. <laughs> Pipes. Oh, what? Well, you meant to grab that! Ooh, <laughs> a little bit of a low jump there. Uh, yeah, we've got more pipes on the other side. Again, more time for you to think as a player. What do you do in these sections? You know? You have to choose where you want to go. Choose your own adventure. There you go. All to hit this button. To raise a gate. I do like the sense of scale, like the fact that like, you know, you know, there's no vehicles. You're just kind of going. And yet you somehow scale this like really large room. Dice have always had like a good feeling with that, even in Battlefield where it's like, you know, you cover large grounds and destroy buildings and things like that. Ugh. <laughs> oh, I got that jump. Eh. <laughs> There we go. More buttons, uh... Just so you don't get your hopes up, don't expect a continuation of the story in Catalyst. I, yeah, I wasn't expecting anything, like, big. I mean, this game sort of is pretty self-contained. This area is cool as well. Like, it's just like... I mean, it sort of presents the first ladder to you right away, so you know exactly where it's sort of funneling you through. But still. I do like me my big rooms and my big set pieces. I don't know why I jumped off that. I'm I'm instinctively hitting left button all the time. I could really stop doing that. My bad. <laughs> but if I was on a mouse and keyboard, I wouldn't be thinking that. There's a lot of rats. How do the rats even get up onto these ledges? They're just good jumpers, I guess. Just like this. <laughs> The rats are running. Oh, true. Maybe that's where she hey, learned. It's like a uh, Toph and the, um... Like they what are they? Oh, oh, oh. My legs. They're higher than anyone these days. <laughs> to be going. fair, though, they rats don't, don't make the here. worst... Um, I was gonna say lab experiments. That's not quite right, but <laughs> you know what I mean. Like rats are pretty smart. Uh, I don't need no... Oh, now I need the ladder. <laughs> oh, hi there. Okay, hopefully they don't see me as I'm going over the slow, <laughs> the slow bar. I, I do say- Oh no! They, they got him! No! <laughs> oh, the poor guy. He was two days away from retirement as well. Take those snipers out or keep out of their way. Just get your ass <laughs> <laughs> Sure, yeah. I like how you can technically snipe these guys if you wanted to, but it's like, you're not the most equipped for this kind of- Ah, my, my neck! Don't worry, I can take a whole sniper bullet. There you go. <laughs> it's like such a change in pace and you honestly don't even need to at all. I know! Whoa. Whoa. That's the whole, that's the whole vibe with this game. It's just like whoa. <laughs> I think that's a glowy object over there. It's the one thing I never enjoy about this game, the pipe walks. Oh, I thought that was a glowy object, but no, it just turns out it's the edge of the platform. It's probably a glowy object all the way down there if you really wanted to, but yeah. 
you're gonna have some like changes of paces here, but it, in the same way as like Sonic the Hedgehog works best when it doesn't throw obstacles in the way that keeps stopping you. Oh, I just realized that's where they are. Hi, they can't see me. I'm up here. No, it's probably quicker to like be over there, right? Because here I am just constantly going out. The patience of a rabid ape. Oh, oh, oh. I've broken my legs again. Uh, where am I even going over here? I feel like it's actually that door and I've just like sailed right past it. Yeah, it totally is just this door. Well, I can safely say me feeling tired is uh, not a thing anymore because I'm having a great time. Authorized personnel only. Well, I'm authorized to do this sick jump. Oh, wait a minute. It's less a 180 and more like a that 80. Except it's, uh, well, it's both, both sides. There you go. It's, I do love this, uh, the slide. Everyone likes a good slide. And then you sort of get to the bottom and you're like, wait a minute, I should have done like a sick jump. Dude, this game is full of weed slides, I tell ya. Yeah, sure, that's, that's how that works. Whoa. Alright, we're nearly out. We just have a very identical room with a bit of water. Side note, uh, Unreal 3 is a very pretty engine. It certainly looks a bit fake at times, but it's like, it gives the effects of... I mean, it, it, there's, a, there's a lot of tools allowing developers to go, yes, like, that is water. And under motion and blurry YouTube videos, that really does look like water. Even up close, it's kind of okay. Until you start seeing it's a bit too wavy in the middle there. Yeah, it, it's, it's plastic, but it's also, like, in the same way as, like, movies from the 80s had very plastic, like, you know, animatronics and things like that. It's like, you get what they were going for, and there's something kind of fun about, like, the very visceral feel- oh, my legs! My legs! Oh, maybe I should go for the side with the ladder. But, yeah. Same thing with, like, you know, most of the shading. It's like, it's very stark. And it lacks, you know, like, ambient occlusion and other things like that. Um, actually, this might have... Maybe this does have ambient occlusion. I don't think it does. And that that lens flare is just going straight to the fence. It's not disappearing at all. But uh, if you ever played Bioshock Infinite, that one's like peak Unreal 3. Which, uh, granted, it's a very late game and Unreal 4 was announced at the time. Um, or like later in that year, so. Now Bioshock 1. That's not even Unreal 3. That's Unreal 2. That still does the job, so. That's always a fun one, <laughs> like how, how kind of these older game engines go. Unreal 5 is, uh, I mean, I've played like Talos Principle, so I know that, but... Unreal 5 is uh, pretty alright. I don't know if it's really that much different to Unreal 4, though. Hold on, I'm like acti- I activated something, maybe... What are you taking in the sights? The blues are already hitting your Oh, yeah, they come. Let me play the whole series. Doing Devil May Cry currently, it's a tight AF, except for the second one. I have not played any Devil May Cry, so I can't tell you much, other than I would like to play them at some point. <laughs> I haven't actually played a lot of, like, spectacle shooters. Oh, we got, a, we got a symbol. But where? Maybe it's on the other side of the box. I'm gonna have a mild gander to try- there it is. Oh, hi there. Ow, my face, I needed it. Just gonna take a shotgun to the face. Ah, my legs, I needed them. <laughs> I didn't do a hot job there. Does that mean I need to pick up the goodies again? I don't think I do, actually. Alright, take two. Ooh, ooh. Okay, that's a bunch of people over there, so let's see if I can just dodge. I would like to use the shotgun at some point, but there are some good opportunities to use it later. It's a hardcore interpretation. <laughs> yeah, a bit. Whoa. There you go. Shotgun, heck yeah. Okay. 
Let's grab the next one. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Where are we going? Oh, well, over there, of course. Is there anything just hiding? Oh, not not at all. The parkour menace. I'm, I, I'm, I'm like, less parkour and more just, I'm gonna like, slap everyone. Oh, I landed on it. Oh, my butt's got little spikes in it. Uh, ooh, the rat knows where to not go. <laughs> Look, Jackknife may know something about Pope's murder, so don't let him wind you up, okay? Oh, that's always he fun. Be a pretty decent runner. God knows who he's working for I've actually now. been in lifts with, like, ads in the, in the, um, the, you know, on the screens. And it's just kind of like, oh, okay. I'm sort of, I'm, like, unfazed by advertising for the most part. Oh, hi there. We're gonna chase him. He's blue. Maybe that was the ghost of our fallen rat, bro. It is. He was reincarnated as another rat. To continue doing what he loved, being a rat. Uh, hold on, hold on. I'm getting that. I just ate a quarter pounder on the way. Ugh. Oh, I missed. I missed my leg day. Hold on. I'm down here. Sorry, bro. <laughs> Sorry, don't run away. Eh. Where'd he go? That away. Okay. <laughs> At least he's taunting me a lot. Wow. <laughs> but yeah, I do feel like it, it, it's strange. As much as like I criticize EA for various decisions, um, I do think that EA is like one of the stronger ones when it comes to like making. Just like smaller whatever titles that are like you know fun for a certain idea um i know they they famously had a it takes two a bit ago and they were trying multiple games from a that same director because they had a, a way out yeah hey, you're losing them. i'm not losing them i would have lost them ages ago had he not like not lost himself okay now i've lost him oh wait he doesn't close doors where could he- oh, of course. The other lift. Do you dream of an apartment on Arlington Drive? Well, in today's day and age, uh, maybe. <gasps> Fats! <laughs> Hi there. <laughs> He's got a very good running- oh! Ooh, ouch. Well. We gotta take the long way while he's at. Yes, that's what I'm going for. Uh, we'll go down here. Because I assume this is where the game's really pointing to. Ah! <laughs> it's like, let me one up you. Oh, I'm still one upping him. <laughs> Proper splatter noise, I tell ya. There you go. Not sure what was going on there, but okay. I mean, if the guy can, like, heal himself just as well as I can, then, uh... Yeah, he's probably gonna be gone by the time I get back. Eh. There we go. Woo! But yeah, I, I do wish that, like, many other companies made uh, these kinds of smaller titles. And I did the thing again. <laughs> Uh, chat's fine. I just don't repeat. That's it. Like, I, I... There's a part of me where it's like, oh, you know, like, I've had a channel since I was a kid. Like, if you go back and you'll just hear, like, prepubescent me going. And so it's like, oh, you know, technically, technically, it's a kid's channel. But it's also like, you know, this, this game swears. I play games that swear. Um... I think it's more just like, I generally just don't swear. Oh, that's not anywhere I meant to go! <laughs> oh, I'm about to Goomba stomp someone. Oh. Poor guy. <laughs> um, yeah, I don't know. I, I've never, like, 
I just don't do... I don't do swearing. But you know what I mean, where it's like, if I can just convey myself any other way, then I would. Why is it... Oh my gosh, I'm an idiot. <laughs> and it's literally the end as well. Uh, but nah, it's all good. It's all good. I know what you're here for, Faithy. Alright, I guess, I guess the only thing is we don't trend towards a, like, a mature... Like, this isn't an adult stream, but it's not like a four-kid stream. It's just like a, ah, whatever. People swear on the internet all the time. Burr feud. Rope burn? Well, he's really just a thug who got lucky. And sometimes people are too ignorant All are welcome. Always want to swim in the big pond. Never see the bigger fish. If I were you, I'd start with that glorified slab of meat. Happy hunting, Faithy. I do enjoy slams of meat. I don't know about going to rope burn straight away. I'm not. I'm going to see Miller. Oh, Faith, what are you doing? You going to tell him about Jackknife? Not yet. He's still a cop. No matter what Kate says. And there we go. That's our third level. Took a bit. Oh no, he wears white. That's how you know. Everyone likes a good, like, Who's sick police know? outfit. I'm Faith. Kate's sister? She never mentioned a sister. Yeah, well, we're not the mentioning kind. She told me to find you if things I love better. games in the 2000s and having completely unrelatable characters. <laughs> we're just trying to be cool. Well now. It's difficult to recall with a gun in my face. I know what you are. You know it was a setup, right? I know Kate wouldn't be capable of something like this. But my captain's oh asking my gosh, she's like question, <laughs> twice as tall as I can't even get in to see her. What do you know about something called Icarus? Why? It's mentioned on this. It was in Pope's hand. I think it's from his diary. You took evidence. Kate's the only family I have, Lieutenant. And Blue's in jail. Don't last long. She goes down for this. It's a death sentence. I won't start. I appreciate this mild world building. That much to Kate. But it's a very straightforward world. Try. Corruption all around. You better learn how to run. And you're just Running uh. I do best. Roped into it, I guess. Is that the the phrase? I was gonna try and do a pun. Oh, never mind. But good thing that you can catch police chiefs in their uh, car parks alone. Ropeburn's got an office at Zeeburfield International Shipping near the Riding Park subway. Should be a sign on top of the building. It'll help guide you. Look, I saw Ropeburn wrestle once. Broke some poor bastard's arm, then headbutted the ref. Specifically, so arm wrestling. That sign can't stop me because I can't read. Yeah, I don't know. There's a general trend. Oh, there was a, there was a hilarious clip of um the Twitch. It was a, is it the actual CEO? Some some kind of present to ow my legs. Um, some kind of for an Orwellian state. There sure are some glaring security issues. Hey, at least there are blind spots. You know what I mean? She runs so fast the cameras can't see her. Even though like in reality it's like yeah nah, that wouldn't last forever. I want to get up there. I really want to get up there, but how? Uh, maybe we'll go over here. Between two ferns, shall we say? Gosh, this built out my legs as well. This building is bright as I'll tell you that. The bl the bloom is hilarious right here. Uh, I don't. <laughs> this isn't even like with HDR on. This is before the days of having HDR all the time. This is just oh, midday. Am I right? I think you gotta, yeah, you gotta sort of. Nope. It didn't quite look right, did it? Ah, <laughs> oh, I'm back here. Done. That one's a very, very me error. Um, but yeah, there's a there's a clip going around of the uh, the Twitch CEO. Um, <laughs> and I I say this uh, sort of like sparingly because we're on Twitch, and I don't know if you can just say I always had a glitchless speedrun skip. I don't know, to me it kind of looks a little glitchy from what I was doing. That's probably a, a better way. Well, there must be a better way. Or a, maybe that is the best way. There we go. Up we are. Keeping the city hydrated and healthy. 
Where's my sponsorship, Mount Franklin? Yeah, this looks a bit better, doesn't it? What? Yeah, I probably want to climb this straight up. There we go. Okay, now I'm on top. Where do we go? We go over oh, there. Oh, I could have just been over there. There we are. Almost there. Ah, <laughs> this is the worst place to land. Listen, I'm not the smoothest. I will absolutely guarantee that. Alright, here we go. Ooh, ooh, straight over the top. Cut you off from the CEO story. Uh, no, it's all good. So the CEO uh, showed off a new feature. I think it was basically like shorts in the timeline because Twitch doesn't really have shorts. And uh, he, uh, he showed off, like, his following feed or something like that. And every single person he, like, showed was just, like, a Twitch, like, e -thought. It was all, like, not a single person playing a game. And I know, like, Twitch is, like, not exclusively games, but it's also, like... <sighs> Please have a checkpoint somewhere before... Yeah, okay. Oh, my eyes! Oh! <laughs> Maybe I should do a brightness warning on this game, I swear. Um, but, uh, but yeah, like, that got me thinking, you know, like, there are probably a bunch of people out there who use a bunch of these websites. Oh, I mean, I mean, to some degree, it's like, do I, do I knock him for following what probably does make most of the traction on the site? Probably, you know. There you go, that wasn't so bad. <laughs> D okay, real talk, like, uh, duh. They'll never find me. They'll never find me. I don't trust these doors that automatically close. Uh, <laughs> you gotta do a roll just up against the wall. Ooh, there's a goodie somewhere around here. Dude, there's so many modern games that have like these kind of like narrow passages that are purely just for loading screens. But where's the goodie? Where is the goodie? It's probably up there. Or oh, that's two of them. Hiding up here? Nope. Where is it? I don't think I know where it is. Oh well. <laughs> we got a giant Z on this laptop. Suddenly now it's a room that's entirely pitch black. The contrast is hilarious. Ah, uh, yes, the code is, uh, 0451. Every time. <laughs> um, but yeah, that got me thinking about, like, how there's probably some people who use various, you know, like, these social media sites generally want to appeal to everyone in some way. And even though that they have lots of these, you know, like, sects of people who, you know, like, all the gamers, all the real-life people, all the music people, and so on, the gambling people, I guess. Those blues. You can tell he's evil because he's got a gun. <laughs> oh, he said the Greek name. He does have beautiful teeth. We can't see it right now, but he does. I'm glad this guy is detailing exactly... Exactly where to be. How many people are going to be there. What they're going to talk about. Frame like this. Man. I wish I knew someone who was built like that. There we go. Okay. What are we looking at in this room in a cutscene? What's the first thing that stands out? So, Ropeburn did know something, huh? Wonder who he's meeting with. Get back here. Gun. We'll, find a way to make you an well, that's pointing that way. Hey, look sharp. I'm getting blue. I'm curious. <laughs> oh, I was like, ah. Oh. <laughs> so now we must break out of the inside of the office. Or just take the. No? 
I guess. Oh, the button's green. It's not red. I can't take it. Oh, well. There's a lot of, like, fun bits of platforming around here as well. Got, like, uh, this bit here. You get to climb up and then... Uh... Oh, okay. Makes sense. <laughs> Come on. There you go. Woo! Don't need no guns anyways. Oh, where am I going? I'm just going all over the place. <laughs> I do like breaking glass, so it's just kind of hilarious. Uh, okay. I'm <laughs> I'm getting myself all turned around. This is when it starts getting a bit more more complex about okay, well I know I need to get up there, but like what am I looking at here? Oh, hi there. Maybe a good jump is all you need. Oh no, a checkpoint literally right where I died. Whoop. Yeah, sure. <laughs> oh man. Uh... But yeah, I'm trying to think, are there any other, like, platforms that are like that, where- Oh, hi there. there. I'm not see ya. Oh, wait, no, that's just the monster closet! No, I've just ran into the monster closet. Let me get out of here. Oh, no, that's just tragic. See ya. The ne <laughs> there was the next exit. Alright, don't trust the insides of buildings. Oh, snap, am I getting flashbangs? Oh my gosh. There we go. They're trying their best. They're be right into the rat trap. They'll never expect me running exactly where they were, as if there were more of them. Time to get a breather. Oh. Okay, you know how this is gonna go. The old school strat. <laughs> what do you mean? I'm just right here. Rat gaming. Drake's gotta hide out up ahead. Head for the cranes and I'll update you when you Almost. Almost smooth. Alright, here we go. Wah. Watch it, babe. The blues have a chopper income. Uh but yeah, no, I uh, I don't know how to really describe the uh like different platforms having different kinds of uh sectors on them. But I guess for me as well, it also means that features like the thing that he showed of shorts really do appeal to different kinds of people. Um maybe there is a huge demand for shorts on all these other platforms. I mean, yes, it works incredibly well for TikTok. But does it necessarily work on other platforms? Uh, the answer is uh, definitely YouTube and probably, you know, most other sites, just videos can naturally be short. Twitch is one where, uh, me, I do enjoy just watching long form content. I do enjoy watching longer streams and deep dives and analyses and discussions about things and not just like quick like spur of the moment stuff. Um, Twitch has always been famous for having famous. It's always been like, you know, the right platform for that kind of stuff. Ouch. I'm glad I activated the quick time just to watch me get slapped slower the next time as opposed to taking the gun off him, but that's what I get for being rusty as and also just running up to someone. Something, something, go the blues. That's a classic New South Wales rugby line. Oh, where am I going? I guess I'm going over here. Enjoy the long streams and social interact. I'm probably not going to get out of here. Oh. If I if my bottom mouth. The long streams is always great, though. And the discussions are always good. Instagram has always been thriving with its own shorts. Yeah, yeah. Instagram is a bizarre one to me because I've always... I've never seen the direct appeal of Instagram compared to just like, why 
not just use Facebook? And I guess the answer is like, it's its own thing. Hey, step on my toes. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, I may be using a controller, but I'm a pretty decent crack shot with it. <laughs> see, I always seek, like, height, but I'm also, like... Am I in that? Oh, yeah, I can't go for height over there. Yeah. I was a teenager when selfies were the thing, so I dove into that world rather deep. Selfies, yeah, selfies started to be, like, alright. I was, like, a very young teen when that was starting to be popular. Like around like 2009. Newest threat to children! Running! Are your children safe? Is your radio transmitting secret messages? Find out what you should know. Five signs someone you know might be a runner. Listen, I'm like... <laughs> Fondness for the color red, I love that. Um, but I, I'm like, man... <laughs> this is like... This came out the same year as Wally, -E, didn't it? Or was that the year before? Or it's just like, ah, oh, exercise? Pfft. We want to keep our, uh, our society, you know, what's the term? Inoculated? Is that the term? Basically, uh, captivated by something else, such that they, they miss the deeper, you know, issues with society. Divide and conquer, get them to fight amongst themselves. None of those characteristics sounded like rats. Rats do like the color red, though, I'll tell you that. I like how I've just <laughs> been attracted to that specific wall. Should be some cover ahead, some scaffolding. Try and lose some of the heat in there. Get in there, get in there. Oh, that's a bit of a jump. We're gonna have to make our way. Oh my gosh, we're gonna have to make our way this away. We're wrong with this rat gag. Dude, we can do the rats until the end of the game. If we keep seeing more rats, it's all good with me. There's some scaffolding. What is. I'm afraid of scaffolding that isn't, like, connected to the ground, you know what I mean? Oh, that's a bit of an interesting spot. Ah, my legs! Ah, my legs! You can't see me- Ah, you could see me. Ah. That's what I do! That's- I get paid to do that. Whoop. Oh. Oh, okay, sure. Can I take a ladder? Heck yeah. <laughs> There's probably a lot of, like, beauty to this level design if you really, really, like, stop and think about it. Because ultimately, it's there to, you know, be, like, naturally run through. Ooh. The NVIDIA physics is working. We're going to make our way down. Not quite. Uh, maybe. Okay, stuff it. We're going for it. Oh, oh, oh. You can't see me. Ah, uh, maybe you can. <laughs> Again, me not going the right way. Oh. Physics is still really cool. There's just something about, like, how, like, modern computers can just run the physics on a software. Wow, I was just facing the wrong way. But, like, you can just, like, do physics in software now. It actually kind of works out right. But, man, is it cool. Man, is it cool. Like that. What? Ugh. <laughs> That's what I mean. That stuff is awesome. That's what technology is for. Lots of games forget. Lots of games absolutely forget that, like, you know, you're partially there to, like, be a cool technology yeah, showcase. Uh... Hang on. <laughs> hang on. <laughs> oh. Is that a satisfying moment? <laughs> Why am I... <laughs> Why am I just getting myself all turned around and stuff here, I swear? Oh, come on, come on. Come on, game. Oh my gosh. I did this before. I can't. I, I... We're getting incompetent. Incompetent days, fellas. Okay, it's 
So we run up to the top. Pipe noises. That's meant to terrify you to turn you around. Okay. Giving the city the energy she needs. We get to, oh, we get to do it again. Second time's a job. Satisfying fall is always good. And then it points up there, which I did not run to. Oh, my legs. I didn't run up that way. I just kind of failed. Oh my gosh. I think it's just because I'm not looking up enough. No. I can't explain what I'm really doing wrong there. Okay, we did it. We're there. Now it's pointing me that away. Like over there. But I mean, I'm here, right? The whole goal is just to get over to this side of the building or onto the building. Maybe that makes more sense. Yeah, that makes more sense. Okay. Oh. You ever watch uh, Tomorrow Never Dies? That. Okay, fence. Ah, my legs. Come on. Come at me, bro. Oh my gosh, hi there. <laughs> He's just hanging out. <laughs> this doesn't get old. This poor guy. This poor guy. There we go. Now we can <laughs> we can take the crane. You know what's the best part? This may be not at all where I like went the first time I played this as well. I might be just going all over the shop. Also, yes, there was a... No, I thought there was a... Ah, my legs! I touched the... <laughs> the pit with the... Oh. Oh. <laughs> Alright. When I said this game isn't perfect, um... <laughs> it happened twice. That's, uh... That's not a good sign. Okay. Point is, we got up here. This is the crane game. Listen, the music's ramping up. You know this is a great set piece moment. It's great. Oh, look at that. Did you just do what I think you did? God damn it, girl. I just spilled my Joe all over the keyboard. Hey, can you get a message to Miller? I need to see him. <laughs> sure. That's that's I I love this aspect. The fact that like Pe different people will play the game differently despite, like, you know, being a game where you just run and you do what, the, you know, you see is in front of you. But everyone's going to respond to different bits of stimulus slightly differently and they go, hey, you know what? Let's add a few routes. The player's going to spot one of them. I received your message. <laughs> it was very beautiful. Why? He's Travis Burfield, Pope's head of security. You think he killed Pope? Maybe. He sure as hell set Kate up. Wanted a cop to go down for it. And he wasn't alone. Heard him mention Project Icarus. Burfield is dangerous, Faith. He's not someone you want to mess with. He framed my sister. I feel like not a lot of people are people for you want what? to mess with. For this. I don't want Kate to go down for this either. But we've got private firms muscling in on our districts. Bolstering city security, they call it. They're breathing down our necks, waiting for us to slip up. The only way they might go easy on us and easy on Kate is if I give them me. Yes. Two guns. All I care about is Kate. And for her sake, I'm going to let you go. But if you pull a gun on me again, I will kill you. Never n always have two guns doing the city a favor actually is that is that a thing are you allowed what are there any police departments around the world where oh yes it's so good are there any police departments around the world where you're allowed two guns at the same time i don't know Wah. there's a bird going in the direction of roeburn's meeting I, it's, it's, it's a different kind of bird there are a lot of helicopters like in this game have you noticed like every level's had one their paws on a bird in this place. Yeah. Double the work, I guess. Keep on street level two. Blues around. Danger, danger. Yeah, test it, by the way. There you go. That's that's the sign. CTS. 
Sometimes you're going fast enough and you can just, you know, clear these jumps. I'm uh, not that great, but good thing that grabbing is an automatic thing. Imagine... I would, to be fair, if if uh, rent prices were okay in this city, it'd be pretty neat. Uh, all these walls are high voltage. All of them. Like, even this one. Ah. Turn it off. I don't know why I turned around there. I'm sorry. <laughs> there we go. Okay. Uh, I'm thinking this route. I'm thinking up here. Looks like you got a, you know, an air duct you could climb around if you wanted to, but we're good. I still want to keep the city hydrated. I still... Okay, real talk again. I, I joke about the Mount Franklin sponsorship, but like, real, real talk, that'd be a fairly unique sponsor deal. It's like, oh yeah, everyone likes water. Right? I don't even drink Mount Franklin these days. City looks pretty neat and clean. Yeah, I, like, I'd be down for it. of a jump. Oh! Ah. Nope. <laughs> the other way. Rat gaming! I don't think these, like, tiles in, like, office buildings can actually hold, like, people. I think they're mostly like, yeah, you can... <laughs> they're sort of just there to... Cover the ceiling, basically, from like, you know, all the... All the wires and air ducts and things like that. Oh! We just keep going. Well, it's not like I've got a choice where I can go at this point. It's the same room as well. <laughs> I don't know why I needed to do that. Uh, side note, Shadow. Love it. Oh, well, Sort of. <laughs> sort of. <laughs> Bit of a jump, ain't it? Why is it pointing up? Oh, it's pointing up. Okay, what we got? What we got going on? Two routes, dude. This game's great. I don't know if down is actually a way to go because that looks like a bit, it's a bit of a drop. Um, so I think in that case, up. Oh, nope. We'll take a bit of a longer run then. Okay. Nope. Almost. I mean, I know that looks like... Can you actually just jump here? Nope. Well, never mind. Never mind. I just don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> uh, okay. I feel like this... <laughs> that wall is probably the best bet. Okay. Good job. Good job. I can't... I cannot do my swings at all. Yeah. There we go. Nope. Nope. Still no. Maybe the <laughs> maybe the key is don't handicap yourself with a controller. There you go. Look at that. I can avoid almost. Can I avoid the swing entirely? Heck yeah. <laughs> we don't need the swing. Okay, here we go. Woo! Yeah, that kind of worked out. Sure. Uh, there was also, um, in the past, not... Not last week. Oh my gosh. <laughs> little tiny, little tiny gap. Not in the last week, but the week before, there was the, um, the Xbox, I was about to call it the State of Play, that's the name of it. Of the PlayStation One, but uh, basically the the Xbox Game Studios big announcement of a uh, ah Steam <sighs> every time. I hate Steam. It's coarse and it gets everywhere. Um, but that was a big announcement of a bunch of Xbox Game Studios games. Um, I feel I haven't written notes on these. I'll probably do a better deep dive uh, next week. Um, and I know I'm probably going to be a few weeks old. Uh, talking about them, but uh, definitely I'm seeing a lot of things of people saying this may be one of the best game announcement shows yeah. of recent times Never trusted a blue, never trusted a blue. Never trusted a blue. 
I'm heading up. See what I can find out about Pope and Kate. Okay. So it's your fault for trusting a cop? Okay. It's not like you were explicitly warned by a fellow compatriot. Oh! Not a 2009 jump scare. Oh, you're right, his teeth is great. Uh. Oh, he's playing with the physics for a bit there. Heck yeah. Oh, he's coming at you with a bat. And then we have uh, the disarm <laughs> quick time event, basically. Better talk fast. I can see your hands starting to sweat. You set up Kate Connors, didn't you? That little cop? Yeah. Had to be a cop, right? I don't mess with politics. Who killed Pope? They are very colorful. No! I, I hired someone. Who? A professional. Meeting him tomorrow, 2 p.m. Take him in the mall, downtown. Help him, bro. Why were you with Miller? <laughs> you sure you want to know about that? Pull me up and I'll tell you. Watch him, Faith. Try anything in your road game. Sure. Sure. Ah! Ah! Uh. <laughs> Shit, Merc, someone's shooting. They got rope burn. Listen, I feel like it should be painfully We're obvious to these cops that he was there. shot in an angle that wouldn't have made sense for this person. Like, that'd be a little weird. Oops. Well, yeah, don't let the- don't let the facts get in the way of a good story, I guess. Oh, hi there. Okay, never mind. I wanted to sail right past- Ah, my neck! <laughs> oh, he's- he's- he's caught onto my tricks. Hi there, where are you gone? There you go. I think we're good, actually. Up into the ceiling. When cops have a chance for a few... <laughs> that is true. That is true. Uh, it's a bit of a drop, ain't it? Beep! Let's go! <laughs> Faith is just like absolutely covered in like spark sawdust right now. Okay, where are we going? To the little tiny red vent. Oh, oh my gosh. We're going somewhere, I tell ya. Seems Jack Knife was bang on the money about rope arm being behind us. Wonder who his professional is. Oh, that was like hold on. I saw the pipes. Oh yeah, the game gets like nutty at this point. Oh, okay. The pipes are where it's at. The pipes are king. Alright. <laughs> Section A1. A1. Oh, boy. Yeah, here we go. Here we go. Yeah. There we go. Signal set. Seems you might be clear of the blues for now. Looks like the Riding Park subway stops closed. Some kind of renovation work. Some kind of renovate? It's only some kind. <laughs> Bit of physics. I'm like right on the surface, bro. Little street sweeper bot doesn't even have cameras in him. Oh. This is a... oh. <laughs> I was like, oh my gosh. <laughs> there we go. Oh, I, I... If I was, like... More agile than I am, I would love to be able to do that. Okay, here we go. Who are we shooting today? You get a shot. And you get the... Okay. Oh. Ah. <laughs> I'll 
get him. Don't worry, I'm not going to do controller aiming. Or well, actually, I am doing controller aiming, but... Oh, oh boy, there's two of them. I'm just going to avoid you. Okay, never mind. Never mind. My legs. No. Oh. I didn't plan anything right, I swear. We'll get there. I have a random Toy Story 3. Dude, the, okay, the Toy Story 3, I have no idea. I have no idea how most of these videos get, like, views, to be fair. Like, I don't know where people find this kind of stuff. The the claim to fame I have is uh, when I was, tw like, 12, basically. Like, crazy young. Um, I had what I can only describe as... Doing too good. Uh, the first Toy Story, a very pleasant Let's Play vibe. I, yeah, I, I thank you very much. <laughs> uh, I try not to, I used to get like very, very riled up like in my younger years, and now I'm just like, hey, it's chill. If I die, I just take another crack at it. There's gotta be a way you can run past and be pacifist about this whole thing. Playing on the train lines, you know? Because, uh, Faith here can't aim. And I'm not very good at this. Okay, we need to, we need to change strats, because I've just, like, run into the same encounter three times, making, you know, less, less progress. Um, but yeah, no, my claim to fame, I feel, is, uh, probably the earliest Toy Story 2 Let's Play on the whole internet, maybe. Because Let's Plays were, like, a something awful thing, um, maybe in, you know, earlier than... YouTube, maybe like 2003, but certainly uh, popularized a bit more by video um, on like Google Video and other platforms um, around there. Uh, big shout out to Proton John was sort of like the big inspiration for me way back when. Um, but then, uh, yeah, no, I, I thought the niche would be to start playing games from, uh, well, I guess they were literally my childhood because it's just like I was a child. but. <laughs> And I take a good shot in the a YouTube account at that time. Don't follow in my footsteps. Um, Rat Gaming is still alive. Whoa. Whoa. Okay. Well, we're taking the low route. The Rat Gaming is back. What? <laughs> Hmm, I guess we... Oh, do we go up? We go up. Hmm, okay. That will be the best route, you'd say. We've got these beams. Hmm, probably this. Just a, a good old... Oh. The fence is making it, like, very awkward. Uh... Yeah, there we go. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I'm not too sure why sometimes I sail right on over. And then I completely flop. There we go. Okay, we're up. I do like me an emergency door override. There we go. Dude, this spot's great. Blue's getting close. Get open, mate. Losing your signal. Cause then it's like, oh, oh, oh! <laughs> hey, 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 hold on. Hold on. <laughs> well, I should be set for like a hot second. Man, they run a lot of trains, because on my, like, train line, it's like, there's no trains for, like... Woo! There was a cop! There was a cop who tried chasing me there! I have never been to a train line where there's a train every, like, 20 seconds, I swear. <sighs> this is what I get for being on the wrong train line. Eh. There we go. Oh, oh, oh. Uh, I'll take the ladder. I'll take the ladder this time. <laughs> there we go. Take two. <laughs> Woo! Air conditioning seven. That is a big air conditioner. Air conditioner. Air conditioning. 
I'm a fan of that. Every time. Uh, but yeah, um, other than that, uh, I guess it's just like, I don't know, it's just experience with the soliloquy. Uh, I, I always enjoy, uh, I enjoy talking, but oh, oh, my feet are in the fan, uh. Um, but I, I enjoy just like a good, you know, chat, conversation, that kind of stuff, and just an idea, a, a way to, to, I guess, convey my ideas in a, in a way that makes sense. There we go. I'm really struggling with the with the pole swings, I tell ya. There we go. Look at this button. Looks like you're in a subway aeration room. Try switching off the fans. Usually maintenance tunnels behind those things. You should get like a big like filter in front. You gotta let us swing of feet. Yeah, okay. Because I sometimes like either instinctively press it or um whatever I go. I actually don't know. I meant to like go back up, aren't I? Alright. It's pointing me up there. Did I just do something really, really wrong or Oh, I thought you could just like completely ignore the platform. Uh we'll take another crack at that. Dude, it's been ages. This is like it's not a blind playthrough, but it's effectively blind for me. I don't know, man. I don't remember too much. Okay, I'm just gonna do the swing again. Yeah, you're right. Watch for the legs. Watch for the legs. Watch for the legs. Alright. There you go. Alright, so I press this button. And then this fan stopped for like a hot second. Which means these fans probably stopped for a hot second. There we go. Just involves running quick. There you go. Oh, everyone likes a good bit of seizure material. Why am I running towards it? Why, why am I running towards that? Well, onto the train line. Oh, not onto the train line we go. Oh. <laughs> I got that. I got it. There we go. We got there in the end. Now I love this sequence. Is it a sequence? I'm pretty sure it's a sequence, because you get, like... Jump scared by, uh... <laughs> things you gotta dodge. Oh. Alright, here we go. Woo! <laughs> oh, it's so cool. Whoa. <laughs> Going quick, we're going quick on the jumps. Oh. Shit, the blues are stopping trains in the tunnels now. Yeah. <laughs> uh huh. Huh. There's a train coming behind you. Get the hell out of there. <laughs> oh no. Oh no. Oh, I tripped over a step. <laughs> Listen, I didn't quite do that right, but it was still effective for me. Hi there. <laughs> I seem to be breaking this game in odd ways, and I don't know why or how, but hey, I'm having a good time. A murderer? Yeah? Yeah. yeah. Hopes. Got a tip off about a meet at the New Eden Mall tomorrow. Gonna pay a visit. Shit. Completely hey, normal. Why are you doing this? It's not your fight. Just, I don't know, lay low. Maybe there's meant to be like an animation of you like flying off. changed. The city's different now. I keep thinking of my folks. They thought this place was something worth protecting. Mom and dad were friends with Pope. Organized protests, lobbied the mayor. Took me and Kate on marches. All my homies hate I surveillance states, really I guess. Why back then. What it meant. Merck said your mom died. She was killed. Gosh, there were missiles? Protest marches that went bad. That's rough. After that, marches, yeah, okay. Well, okay. Much fell apart. 
Dad never forgave himself, and I... Well, I left home soon after. Thank you, bit of, uh, really backstory exposition. Me. That's when you met Merc? He caught me. Always running from place. something. No kidding. He never said that. He offered to train me. Felt like a good way off the street, so I took it. Not much else going for me. What you're doing now, Faith, is the fastest way to get yourself killed. They got my sister involved, Cell. And I need to clear her name. I feel like there's been a lot of much. things I've done this playthrough so far that's been faster ways of getting that's killed. What we do. The train! Survival is overrated. You need to live a little, too. Ooh. Hey, you want to come with me tomorrow? Could use the help. Can't. Drake's got me on a job. Says I've been slacking. Look, I've got to go. It's fine. Someone's bound to start shooting at me soon. Get going. Faith. Take care. Well, as long as she's not two days away from retirement. I've already done that one already, haven't I? I've already <laughs> said that one. Everyone likes a good mall level. Okay, off we go. Off we go. But yeah, poor rat. I know, I know. We shall remember him. We're just hopping down to the street. That seems to be what we're doing. Yes. <laughs> Whoa. Uh, uh, <laughs> I <don't laughs> I'm not 100% sure what I did wrong there. There we go. <laughs> right through it, exactly. Hey, if, the, if this was like for a speed run and I really didn't know what I was doing. Hey, he's back. He's taking shelter. He knows. Um, listen, yeah, if I was going for like crazy speed runs, oh boy, I'd probably be upset about how many like weird things I'm doing. You know what probably is like contributing, bleh, contributing to it? Just like running at like, um, you know, higher resolutions and refresh rates than normal. Wait a minute, I'm going that away. Um, that's usually the, the, you know, where things can go wrong. Um, obviously the best games would never be affected by that, but hey, you can never guarantee things. Right, up we go, we should be able to get onto the tracks now, and now we are getting flashbacks. Uh, which way, which side did the trains run on? That side, got it. <laughs> you want me to point out a fun easter egg? Oh yes, I do like me a good fun easter egg. So, did I just die full damage? Blendo continues to break the- oh, was that the train? Oh, the other way. Ah. It sounded like full damage. Technically, uh, I'm falling horizontally at a very, very fast rate. I do like these, uh, arrows pointing your way to go as well. None of it feels quite like force, because it's, you know, just signs are there for maintenance people. Okay, that was definitely the train. I'll, t I'll guarantee that one. But yeah, I, I'm curious about, like, you know, where is the, the direction of EA as a company? I don't really, you know, most gaming companies. Uh, Xbox seems to be, you know, they have a bunch of stuff in the works. But it's also, like, how much of this is just because they've been acquiring, like, studios? And how much are, like, actual, you know, demos? I'm going to be patient. We're going to be patient this time. I see the train. Hold on. They can't get me because I'm pausing. Now I'm going to wait for that train, and now we're going to have a go. There you go. And that's going to be, like, you'll see the checkpoint marker in the bottom left right now. Oh, hey, get off there. 
Now you'll see it. Maybe? Lots of rats though, I'll tell ya. Oh, they gave me the red carpet treatment and everything. Hi. Whoop. Ah. Threat to our way of life. Oh, oh, urban myth. There is still a November. Never trust at Tazbekistan. I swear. 200 casualties. Jeez, man. Oh, hi. <laughs> um. But yeah, no, I, I, I'm curious where they'll be. Uh, I do worry about, like, the big state of, you know, game studio acquisitions because, um, I sort of, I, I don't know if I've mentioned it on stream, but I've definitely mentioned it to a bunch of my mates. I'm very worried about, like, you know, like, uh, id Software, you know, famous for making Doom, uh, bought by Zenimax, took forever to make, like, more games after that acquisition. That happened in, like, 2008, 2009? And it was sort of like just meandering around and making rage, sure. But then it was another five years until they released Doom. I guess they, you know, had the, the rights, not the rights, but like, you know, they, they got another studio to... Why am I climbing this? Why, where am I? Oh, there we go. I was like... Uh, they got another studio to make Wolfenstein, um, the new, uh, the new order, which... I do really like that game's good fun. Maybe one day I'll play it. Uh, oh boy, where can you find the uh, the goodies? Maybe the roof, which I've just completely skirted around. Hold on, oh no, no, you need to get to the roof, please. You gotta stop for a moment. I'm looking for a, a goodie bag. Ah, oh, cheeky spot. <laughs> please stop! Please stop leaving these things around. Alright. Ow, I'm not doing it. Yeah, more. The rat is leaving the messages. The rats are really the protagonists of this game. Uh, this is gonna be a roll jump. Okay, stuff it. <laughs> Just land right onto my legs. Okay. We're gonna do a most insane jump kick. I missed. The unspoken heroes. Uh, <laughs> we did not do the most insane jump kick, and instead I'm just right back where I, right back where I left off. Ah. You know, I feel like fighting these. Guys, uh, I should really go for a, a disarm, shouldn't I? I think a disarm is probably the best thing to do. Oh, come on. There it is. What does it doesn't matter. Oh, ooh. <laughs> it doesn't matter with a disarm when I'm doing it out in public, you know? Hold on, we'll, we'll lure him over. Hi. Lure him over. Oh, no, no. You're almost there. You're almost there. There you go. I'm really not having a good time, aren't I? I'm actually curious, because I know I played the game on, on a mouse and keyboard the first time. I'm very curious. I re this really shouldn't be like a me on controller thing. I'm not going to blame me on controller. I'm just going to chalk it up to me just being bad. But I do have good aim. I do have fairly alright aim. Uh, I think that was, that was all it was. Three people. I died like four times against the same three people. Granted, everyone is a pretty good shot until you're running, and then they're not a good shot. But when you're not running, you suffer. Ah, uh, cool. I am doing. That is right. Oh. That's where I came in, right? That is right where I came in. Okay, we need to go up. We need to go up. <laughs> you are doing. Hey, it's better than I, I did a replay of um Barbie Super Sports. 
I know, it's a Barbie game, it's like, what do you expect? But it's like, there's something uh, absurd about like how Barbie's always like, we're doing a great job, we make a great team. It's like, how much is Barbie doing and how much am I doing? Uh, because if I look at it like, you know, virtually, it's like, well, Barbie's doing nothing. She's a video game character. She's not doing any of the inputs. And if I look at it like, in terms of, you know, what she's doing, it's like, man, I'm the one sitting on the couch pressing a bunch of buttons and she's the one like, actually doing the sports. Who's doing the stuff here? A nice commercial liner. Boeing's got their stuff together. I honestly don't know if the Boeing stuff is just because more people are reporting on it or whether it's actually because it's happened more. You're close to the mall, Faith. And the whistleblowers are mysteriously dying. True. That game is fairly just Yeah. Oh. That was <laughs> really should oh good thing it checkpoint me there I'm just like I'm looking at it going I that's like a super obvious like you know jump like that and I've just <laughs> completely ignored doing it climbing up the rooftops uh what else did I play in the past week I played um oh you know what I played in the past week I played Charlie and the Chocolate Factory on the PS2 uh, which, uh, is by High Voltage. Mm -hmm. That is another point of, let's just ignore them. I really should be ignoring people. I'm like, ooh, glowing people. The glowies. Here comes some fun stuff. We've now got to switch power lines. Power lines? There we go. Are these actually power lines? I don't even know. Just some good old-fashioned running, you know? Ooh. There's a goodie around here. Where's the goodie? Because I know if I jump back there, I'll, I'll have missed it. Where is the goodie? Is it on top? You didn't hide the goodie on top, did you? Oh, he hit it on top, the cheeky lads. But no rat message this time. I'm missing out. I'm missing out on my rat message. Oh. <laughs> There's a fence in the way. Okay. Um, Charlie and the Chocolate Factory on the PS2 is one of the worst games I've ever played. Um, nostalgia aside, for the people who did play that game ages ago, um, you like it's very mindless. It has this like mechanic where you can signal Oompa Loompas to do your bidding. Um, but the problem is that it doesn't really, uh, <laughs> like, expect the player to, like, think of what they're doing. It's just like, you must interact with this. Now you must interact with this. Now you must interact with this. Oh, look, some robots. Please do the one attack you have in the whole game. You do get a couple of other attacks later on. But it's just like, well, you just use the best thing you have because all the robots are the same. And then eventually the game is done in, like, five hours, and then... Willy Wonka's like, uh, actually, you need to get, like, the extra tokens on these other levels, which... <sighs> I hate it when the building, the, the swivelly doors don't work. Um, and so you're just forced to go back into three levels that you've been to already, flying around because you've got fizzy lifting drink. And then, uh... Like, you just pick up a bunch of tokens, you don't actually even do a puzzle. It's very, very odd. Um... The, the game has one singular saving grace, and the music is fairly alright. That's what it is. Oh, look at that! Oh, my legs. Um, the music is by the, uh, same composer that did, uh, God of War that same year. Uh... This isn't... No, this is Rat Gaming. I guess it's as good as mine translating that, though. There was a point in time where 50% of the games were like that. Yeah. I've played a lot of, like, average games, though. This one is, like, shocking, though, because uh, there's a lot of hilarious and somewhat not as hilarious bugs. Oh, hi there. Um, there was one level near the end of the game that involved a lot of just mindless back-and-forthing. And, um... 
I had a- Hey! Hey! How you met? What the heck? We'll probably have that answered very soon. Okay, in that case, let's, uh, not run headforth into people. Ooh. Can I just... Heck yeah. Ah. Ah. <laughs> okay. See ya. I'm out of here. <laughs> um, but yeah, I think like the, this Charlie and the Chocolate Factory game is uniquely really, really rough for what it is. I don't think I've played like when I say it's one of the worst games I've ever played. Like I think it does really, really, you know, need quite a few, you know, marks against it in order for me to like really start thinking that. Um, I've played through a lot of like other licensed games around, um, maybe not specifically around that time. Um, uh, yeah, this this room. I always have nightmares about not navigating this one right. Ooh, actually. Oh, I wanted to do a wall run there. That would have been neat. Oh well. Hello, 911. I'm being shot at. Actually, here's a question. What country are we in? Because even though everyone speaks English, there's a lot of, like, boxes and signage that are in a... Mandarin, I'd imagine. Like, hold on, next time I stop. If they're not done, you get them for free. Wow. Um, well, that's not an... That's a different language entirely. Uh, see, I wanted to do, like, a fun run there. But, uh, oh. All got some support structures and maintenance areas at the top. There should be a way out up there. Okay. Let's let's stop like just dancing around. Let's get let's, let's get the good jump. Oh! I no 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 I'm uh I've died on the pot plant. Fictional country cities called Glass Glass City. It's like um which which one's Edge City? Is that a that's Son of the Mask, isn't it? Singapore vibes. Yeah, Singapore. Singapore's got this, like, kind of highlights, kind of aesthetic going on, uh, as someone who's never been, sorry. Because really my goal is to make my way to this direction, and then up. Oh. Well, it was a lot simpler than I expected. And now suddenly everything's white. Apparently it is the mask, yes! <laughs> Or if it's Son of the Mars, it's secretly Sydney, because, like, it's, it's just Sydney. I've been there. That's, they just filmed it at Martin Place, that's it. You think rope I always love that when it's like I recognize, like, somewhere. It's like, um, you ever watch The Matrix? And you get that one scene of the, the girl in the red dress at the fountain? That fountain is also Martin Place! It's also Edge City! It's hilarious. It's, it's great. I feel like a lot of people probably have that around, like, Los Angeles, because it's just like... Every, you know, not every movie, but like a lot of movies are, you know, filmed around Los Angeles. A lot of music videos as well. Okay, the rat knows something I don't. Roger? Who's Roger? Hold on, I want to play with the Phys -X a little bit. <laughs> I have Phys -X all over myself. It's quiet. Too quiet. Oh! The burning orange sun. Oh, hi there. Hey! Oh! Hands up! Don't shoot! I'm not doing a good job here. Oh! I might be alive, I might be dead. No, I'm good. Okay. We're gonna make a- make a proper getaway. Faith, you can't aim! Oh my gosh! I'm aiming right at him. You've got all the bullets in the world. You didn't even make it happen. What are you doing, Faith? Okay, well, we're just going to make a bit of a, you know, a bit of height. I appreciate the game is just continually telling me that something is out of order. Maybe it's the subtitle. The subtitle itself is out of order. Uh... How do I get up there? 
this will do. <laughs> Just keep running around. I'll find it eventually. Oh boy. Thank you for shooting that out of the way. The ultimate test. <laughs> the ultimate test. Can I do my swings right? Oh, now I gotta break myself in again. Alright, here I go. Not a goddamn machine gun. Alright. Take two. Take two. Alright. Eh. Oh, oh. It's a bit too preemptive. Okay, take three. Take three, we'll get that. Oh, hi. <laughs> there you go. But yeah, I'm curious as well, like, what's, uh, what's the the next for, not specifically Mirror's Edge, but just parkour games in general. Don't say Minecraft, because I know a lot of people do with Minecraft. This game's got its flow, it's got its kind of, you know, its glue. It gives you a bit of wiggle room. And a bit of flair. But it comes very naturally. I guess as well, like, I, I complain about the game being short, but then it's also just like, well, you know. They're designing a bunch of areas with multiple routes that you're gonna just run through. You know. What do you do? And don't say open world, because that's what they did. Looks like my little friend is back. Hi, little friend. I don't know, but I think I know someone who does. Oh, I love it when the music comes back for a hot second. What is this name for, like, this, uh, this style of animation? I, I, I'm, I feel like I've seen it a lot in, like, particularly French circles. Like, it's like a French animation technique. Where it's like, it's, it's not cell shaded, but, well, it is, I guess. With a little bit of persuasion, Wilburn was pretty chatty. Told me about his meeting with Pope's killer at the mall. And you're thanking me, right? But when I got there... Guess who was waiting for me? No idea. Rope, but wait. I just go there for the pretzels. Bad case of the blues. You wouldn't happen to know anything about that, would you? No, Faithy. It wasn't me. <laughs> Besides, if I wanted you dead, don't you think I would have just killed you myself? You're right. A creep like you couldn't have organized. Now, don't be like that. Ropeburn's dead. I'm impressed. Wasn't me. You need to be careful who you hang around with. Oh, I learned that a long time ago. And yet, here we are again. Okay. But I'm afraid I'm gonna have to cut this little meeting short, thinking. Places to be. You know how it is. People to do, things to see. To Wait. Self killed. Merc. Merc, you can stop pretending not to listen now. <laughs> What's up? Can you do a search on Perandello Kruger security? On it. Why do you ask? Been seeing their name around. In Ropeburn's office and somewhere else. Distinctive logo. Getting anything? Mm, just what you Classic expect. advertising. Alarms, fencing, you just, cars, just get in. private security. Oh, and they secure our world, apparently. Oh. Where are they based? A few offices around town. Just got a new place down near the docks. Get me some oh, they spell harbor the, with a U. Oh, it is Singapore. That's how you know. Or at least somewhere that uses British English. I'm actually curious, because, like, isn't DICE in, uh, Sweden, aren't they? They're a Swedish studio. Un unless it says DICE LA, really talking. The big stupid dog! Okay, well, we got a few- oh, I was gonna say we got a few routes, but my brain was like, I can just break this window and jump out. Nope, not quite. Can't see red Swedish, my lovely neighbors. No way. That was a pun. I hope you appreciate that. <laughs> Unless it's Finland, the other neighbor. I oh, I, real talk. I cannot remember what order they are in. When it comes to oh, there's a goodie somewhere here. But where? Oh, cheeky lads. Cheeky lads. 
Oh. I hit the jump away from all Finland. Good pun though. Oh, I am I am finished. I'll tell ya. Where are we up to? Level seven and I still keep instinctively hitting the turnaround button at the worst possible op opportunities. Wait, this is where I came from. Whoa. So where would the goodie be? Maybe it's turning around or mm, Oh well. Oh. <laughs> Chapter 7, yes. I'm going for it. <laughs> I don't need no stinking rope. <laughs> There's something kind of nice about being able to run around a street for once. Uh, even if I'm not really going to run around the street very nice. <laughs> New Zegas in Chapter 8. I wanted to just skip the po uh, popes, the pipes. There was a pope earlier. Listen, when you call yourself pope, I'm not saying that the pope is controversial, but the pope is obviously like a symbolic leader. And uh, sometimes, in a corrupt society. I don't know where I'm going with this, because I don't have a specific example that I'd be pointing to. So it's like, yeah, evil people are bad. Like, that's really my point. <laughs> it's always a bit like, kind of like, yeah, yeah, duh, you know, when it comes to like plots and stuff that do that. And I'm not like knocking stories that do have very straightforward plots where like, obviously, you know, every politician and police guy in this is like evil. Like, sure. But you know what I mean, where it's like, there's, uh, some people seek for a, a very, very complex or rich and deep story. I need to get around to the other side and or climb up there. Okay, but I've really not given myself many options, have I? So, either I jump up a pole or I just try and wing this. That's, can I, nah, not really. What am I doing here? What am I doing here? I got a trading card though. That's cool. Oh. Listen, it works in another level. Okay. Oop. Not sure why I'm struggling to climb up, but sure. Okay. Okay, so now we finally made it up to the top and I can just walk over this fence. That was the whole reason why we're doing this. And then I jumped onto another fence. Okay, we're gonna... We're gonna sneak. Woo! Woo! I'm glad he's going for the point-blank shot, though. No, there's no status. He's, he's fine. He's waving his hand. See, he's fine. He's fine. Okay, where are we looking at? Oh, oh. Shoot him in the nuts. That's, that's, that's not a laser. Oh, you want some too. Ouch. In the elbow. Everyone likes a good old one-shot sniper, you know? <laughs> yeah, sure, okay. Alright, now I just need to make my way uphill. Yeah, I was thinking this way. Uh, seems a bit odd. But sure. No, not quite. Why is it. What is it pointing me to here? The, the pipe? I think I've. Just need to get down from here, that's really the, the key. Yeah, yeah, I was thinking, I was like, yeah, there's probably just something on the ground floor. I'm getting myself hitched up about the clue system, and the clue system is like, oh, I didn't, I didn't think about, like, standing here. What is this, SD45, what is that, paper? 
There's a part of me that's like, I really do appreciate in a very, very digital world we're in where it's like, you know, we're not spamming as much paper as we used to, because, oh my gosh, how did anyone manage anything back then? So much manual labor dealing with the paper, let alone... Ah! Ah! Ooh. Okay. Uh, well, cli oh. No more climbing. We're leaving. Um, but you know what I mean? It's like... A lot of people... Oh, hi there. Ah. I, tr I tried to decide... I'm not getting my real... My, like, real-time timing very well. Maybe I should just, like, use the, the reaction thing a lot more. Yeah. A part, a part of me... Oh, my gosh. That was, that was a bit of a yikes there. Oh, my gosh. Alright, take three. Oh, and I still botched it up, even in slow motion. There you go, I got it this time. We're good, we're good, I got it. I assume for speedrunning you want to activate the slow motion as little as possible. Oh. <laughs> Come on, invincible paper box. Oh boy, I'm out. Okay. We got him. It's all good. No sweat. First try. That was a monster closet. Looks like PK had their offices somewhere ahead. I could have just shot the explosive barrels. That would have been alright. Wouldn't it? Man, I can't believe they locked all the rooms. What are they looking at on the computers? Ugh, screensaver. Ugh! Just turn the monitor off at that point. What are you, why is it gonna be on? Dude, there's a lot- I mean, I know it's a very 2009 thing to just have, like, the office computers, like, hanging on. Screen's always on, we can't have that stuff off. Okay, they're pointing me towards this door, but I'm probably red herring going around the wrong way. Where am I? Uh, staircase. Door. In that case, then actual jump from there. Yes. Okay. I'm puzzle solving. I'm getting there. Listen, I, I actually kind of like how it's been so long since I've last played this that... I've probably forgotten a lot of the level design I'm just sort of going on. I know roughly where the story's going. Uh, I'm obviously not collecting every single doodad because... I'm doing okay, though. I'm about to get steamed, aren't I? Ooh, it's a bit steamy down here. These things, they take time. Maybe you just go through the steam. We'll just go through it. What's the worst that could happen? It's a bit hot and steamy. Yeah, I, I mean, I, I will say that you know, I've played it before, so it's not like completely unknown to me. But it's unknown in the sense of just, I According don't quite fully remember. Or really, mostly remember. I do know probably way more of the last level than like some of the other ones, but I do remember like this warehouse level really being like the trickiest one for me. Okay, that door is definitely the key to where we go. A decade is, it is true, it is true. My memory's okay with some things, but not like a lot of things. Okay. I'm gonna go around to there. Door there. I'm just like thinking in 3D space. I'm just going, okay. Where do they want me to like lean off to? Uh. So yeah, they're really pointing over there. Um, hmm. 
Hurry up before they find you, Faith. I'm trying, I'm trying. Okay. Uh looking up at the ceiling. Probably gonna do all this jazz over here. You know, I start to take it back a little bit. I think that the action. Oh my gosh. Maybe I could just do it from here. Yeah. Um, I start to take it back about, like, the level variety, because I'm like, yeah, you know what? You got these kind of more complex levels that aren't necessarily all about, like, I mean, you, c you can eventually have a path and really, like, nail running through these bits, but. Uh, oh. I'm good. I'm good. I saved it. <laughs> um, but it's all about, like, finding a way. Wait. I'm looking at the sun again. There we go. Uh, yes. There we go. Oh, look at that. First try. Push button. That's just an answering machine. Okay. Alright, so we've turned on the conveyor belt, which means I can now go down the conveyor belt. Whee! And a bit of physics. I love those like plastic flaps. I've got um I've got a seafood place near me. And they have these plastic flaps. It's like so vintage. Like it, it's just to keep like birds and stuff out, but it's just like actually as well, I went to a shopping center near me and um they uh replaced well not replaced but they installed on top uh hold on I walked up these steps ah. uh they, they installed these um uh like plas plastic they're probably plastic uh, screens I guess I'm going down we're going down um these plastic screens just along the ceiling that are like the vertical but they're also <laughs> I'm wandering around a very like odd area I have no recollection of like this area I tell you okay hold on wait how did I even get in here what hold on okay <laughs> um and, uh, and they're just meant to like, you know, I assume dissuade the birds. That, okay, so that's obviously not the jump, but then it's like I have no downward path from here. Hold on, I, I'm getting myself so spatially turned around right now. This obviously goes down and I'm up on this ledge, but I've sort of found my way onto this ledge. We've got this room here, where you've got this kind of bar over here and this kind of bit where I could jump up into, but... I'm sort of at the ceiling. There's nowhere else I can really lean off to. And then that's... That's that, right? Like, that's this room. I'm getting myself incredibly lost. Hold on. I'm seeing the bar down there. I see the forklift here, which... And the ladder there. Hold on. And this whole wall is... Hold on, I'm actually getting... Part, oh, okay. Give me a hot minute, and I'll probably nail this. I'll be like, yeah, I feel smart. And that, that's not something you interact with. Oh my gosh, I just, I'm just looking at like walls of red. I got there, I got there in the end, I got there. Okay, and now we jump. We got it, we got it, it's all good, don't worry. I'll be doing a wall run to make that work. Oh, my legs. That's okay, we got there. Uh-oh, evil computer. Hey, man. Yeah, I know. I really don't dust. <laughs> oh, my gosh. From Mark? This guy is very angry. He's so angry he managed to fit this all in one square screen. Don't you? I... Yeah, true. I'm actually, oh, dude, I'm actually, real talk, I will check out your run, um, like, t 
tomorrow when I wake up because I'm going to be like bonkers tired at the end of this. But uh, uh, okay, we are. Uh, I mean, that's that window sort of looks like where I want to go, but not quite. There's also that door with the message and feels right. Obviously, I'm not interacting with anything in here, so... Oh, there you go. Hey, I like good... Commentary is commentary. It doesn't matter how cringy you are. There's some there's some merit to just, like, putting yourself out there. You know, for the world to see, the world to hear. Um, and to just, you know, do what you enjoy doing. Okay, well, I'm in a corridor. Portal is really... I do enjoy Portal. I can do a much quicker Portal than I can a Mirror's Edge, I'll tell you that. I do like how these levels, you know, move from one location to another as well. Like, I know that seems fairly normal, but it's like... That's like the beauty of Half-Life. Portal glitchless time is 16.25. Ooh, that's really good. That's way better than me. I can do like 40 minutes. <laughs> I have some okay, like, cuts, but nothing really that significant. Everyone likes a good mirror reflection. It's like the name of the game. Could be some kind of training room. Drake. What are they training them for? You mean there's something less than the city they haven't managed to tax, ban, or regulate? Oh, she gets five foot nine. Us. Mark, get your gun. You know, that's never too far away. Why? This... This training, Merc. This Project Icarus, Pirandello Kruger, they're not here to bolster the police. They're being trained to come after us. After the runners. All the runners. Everything okay up there? Quiet as grave. Just me, birds, and the best black market surveillance equipment money can buy. It's him. Him? The guy I saw at the mall. I've seen him on a camera, on the deck of a boat at the dock. Walk in faith. You've done enough. Right now, it seems you're sitting in the lion's den. So ah! Please, like the logo. Oh, it's a pitbull, never mind. Do you like me a good old five? Chatter's gone berserk. Blues know you're there. Get out now. Oh, shit. Hi there. Okay, see ya. I love, like, this whole area is just like a playground. Like, no way would anyone ever, like, design this, like, arrangement of platforms if it wasn't for someone to like run around on it and oh, other than me botching my own stuff uh they're gonna try and run after you as well which is the uh sort of terrifying bit they're training guys to check i'm doing it again Woo! Woo! <laughs> oh this is chapter six hold on i thought it was chapter seven are we not seven Ooh. i'm taking my sweet time then Unless your thing is chapter 7 that you're thinking of. Hi there. As long as you don't stop, it's just the Shadow Mario rule. Just don't stop. The first one is the prologue chat. Oh, it's a chapter 0. Oh, okay. I thought the training was like a chapter 0. Makes sense, yeah. Okay, where am I going? Lift seems like a good idea. I see you, fellas. I wish I could, like, see the lift closing on them. Illicit transport at an all-time high. Thank you, Nelson Trademark. Hey, you're not putting trademark next to all uses of Nelson. Oh, hi there. Hi there. Yes. <laughs> we don't do doors where we're at. Get <laughs> barge to the glass. It's so good. It's so cool. This turns out the Easter egg is in nine. You gotta catch a train soon. Heads up, it has to do with the sniper rifle. Alright. Sniper rifle in level 9. I will mentally note that. Oh, there you go. I dodged him. Chapter 8, level 9. Oh, so, okay. So, the level numbers are correct. Just my chapter numbers are wrong. There's some train tracks up ahead of you. Could be a way oh, out. Whoa. <laughs> Bit gutsy there. Unfortunately, I've stopped the music, so it's not as dramatic right now. Whee! You by the tracks? It's a ride, girl. I'm not by the tracks yet. 
Oh, hi there. <laughs> They're struggling to follow me at times. Uh, okay, well, in that case... Just jump down here. Oh, hi there. <laughs> Every time. That's just how the game ends. She just misses the train by just a, just a teeny tiny bit. I wish I could get some fast, secure broadband and a... <laughs> okay. <sighs> Raposa. Alright, third time's the charm. I do like how cars look like that nowadays. That work. This wasn't the train I was jumping on. I was jumping on the other track, was I not the first time? Do it. I'm going after that guy. I guess they're both going the same way. Makes sense. And I ran. You gotta you gotta mention that song every time, right? Quick, these cutscenes may or may not be uh, just hiding a loading screen. <laughs> now, I love the nighttime and the green. It's just a f so fun inversion of the colors. This level, make your way back to the station. Be back, enjoy the cruise. I will enjoy the cruise. Enjoy, enjoy the train. And uh, I'll be sure to try and look for a sniper rifle secret. Okay, here we go. Not like that. Not like that. Okay, we sneaking. We jumping. I mean, it kind of looks like I'm meant to go that way. Does it not? I'll just... Not with the gusto I had last time. Uh, woo. Look at that, I'm not breaking my kneecaps today. I like how they got this little truck here just so you can, you know, leverage as well. Oh, <laughs> we're getting into the truck. What the hell is in this boat anyway? Trucks, I guess. No idea. Could be munitions, I guess. Might be to do with this project, Icarus. Look, head straight to the deck if that's where you saw this guy. Once you found your killer, get some answers and get I'm out. sorry, <laughs> Zed fighting. It does so the LOD. The, oh no, what's the term? Frustrum culling. It's a little bit too soon. Hang on, that's just Japanese. This is just kanji. What was that saying? I know that's toe con. I forgot what letter that is. But this is katakana, so it should like sound like an easy word. Who knows? We're still moving. My controller's vibrating. I'm gonna put the control on the mic. Oh, and it stopped. <laughs> The ominous start to an ominous level. Are we good? Can I? Oh, oh boy! Woo! Ah, oh, again! I, s <laughs> I swear I did that right. There we go. Yoink! I'm gonna want this, and I'm not gonna want to die like that. I feel like you just want to run quick. Just don't bother. Don't bother. We're trying to be slow. Now this. This is a gun. Okay. How we dodge our way through this corridor. We gotta have an alternative route somewhere, right? Right? Just weave in cover. I'm not doing- I'm not- I'm not having a good time with my combat. I'm really not- not doing too hot there. 
Uh, okay. Well, let's go quick again. Let's just get him while I'm a bit closer to them. Go, go, go! Whoops. Give me another one. Give me another one. There you go. That's a different gun. That's like an RPK, man. Are these just like... Lingering battlefield assets? I'm actually curious. Because <laughs> uh, they would have been working on Bad Company 2 at this time. Which is a GOAT game, by the way. There's something like... Unparalleled with how that game's destruction works. You know, there's there's more dramatic destruction in other games, but nothing like feels as important to your gameplay as it does in that game. Every single building is like a liability. Nope. <laughs> oh. Hi there. It's got the crazy eyes. Ah, oh, come on. I'm pressing the button just like that tad bit too soon. Okay. Oh, I got my gun. Shoot him in the nuts. Shoot him in the nuts. There's another guy around here. Oh, hi there. Okay, cool. There we go. Well, the music's slowing down, so I'm thinking I don't have to shoot any more Toyota Camrys. Actually, are these like Chevrolets? Almost. They got barcodes for the for the numbers as well. It's the best part. I'm gonna need to, you know, capsize the ship. You need to find a way off those car decks, babe. I'm turning valves, man. I'm turning valves. You can't stop me. I'm turning them. Okay, where are we going? This way. Sneaking through things. Again, I want to say I am really loving the variety after like playing this through again. And it all kind of works out. Like, even if every level is, you know, like things do slow down and they start getting a bit technical. You know, you've got, you've still got your skills. Just contextually they apply somewhere else. Uh... Just jimming the whole way? I think I am, yeah. Wow. I think the the whole it's all in first person really plays oh, really gives you some like I don't want to say immersion as like a oh it's a be all end all, but like in the same way as like Half Life. Conveying as much as it can in first person is great, although, you know, I guess I got some external cutscenes here and there. My guy? Eh. <laughs> Alright, take two. Take two. This probably makes a lot more sense. There we go. Now I gotta turn around. Nope. Nope. Still not quite. We'll get there. We're getting there. We're getting there. Where, where am I going? I don't suppose we grab it now. Okay, we're, we're just gonna keep like doing grab jumps all over the- No! Ah, come on! Come on, I was right there. Listen, the perseverance. We'll get there. We'll get there. Persevere. That's my middle name, apparently. Ugh. There we go. First try. First try. And now I gotta not botch this up if I needed to keep jumping somewhere. I think we're... Oh. That's somewhere I want to jump up to. And the 
this is a walkway. Okay, okay. So, uh, I don't suppose this is a jump from that angle, right? No. Alright, so, she doesn't really, yeah, she doesn't really grab there. Okay, uh, my gut feeling is just like, let's just try and jump towards here and see what it is. Unless it's, no, it's not down there. Um, yeah, no, it's definitely up. It's definitely up, because that's glowing. Uh, oh my gosh, why am I... How do I... Whoa, whoa. This seems like a prime, like, wall run wall. Nah. <laughs> hey, at least it saved me up here. We're puzzle so oh, come on, come on, Faith, you don't need to keep looking down. We're puzzle solving here. This wall's a bit too slippery. We do have the walkway up there, but it does look like it dead ends, and I, I'm trying to peer up around there. That's walled off. Unless, mm, yeah. Yeah, yeah. He said they reported a lot of already on that boat. But he seen what he thinks is your guy on the top deck. I do remember it might have actually been this bit. This is the bit that I like could not for the life of me figure out. Uh, but since it was like 2013, it was like, oh just you know, look up a walkthrough or something. Uh, I'm gonna try and be gutsy and not look up anything. We're gonna try try just slamming my head at a brick wall. Jumping at everything. This is my Duke Nukem 3D brain going just, you know, you press E on everything. It's just go, uh, uh, where is it? <laughs> like, just constantly until eventually some mystical wall opens up and you're like, ah, that makes so much sense if I just, like, thought about it for two seconds after knowing it was there. See, okay, that's where I want to be. I want to go up there. Uh, this is not something I can break through. Um,. How do you, like, hang on the bottom there? There's definitely nothing on the top here, so... Makes sense. The vector is lining, leading me this way. Unless this is just, like, a higher ledge. There we go. There we go. Whoa. Okay. We got there. We got there, guys. We did it. I figured it out. <laughs> Woo. Okay. Oh. Okay. And that... Whoa. Okay. Oh, <laughs> she's looking a bit too far off. Oh, just, just climb up, man. Just climb up into it. Okay. Oh, we did it. We got the, we got the. I figured out the room that I could never figure out. Still got to keep turning valves and stuff like that. Deck six, more like deck not. I don't know. Should be a way through to the top deck above you, near car deck six. There we go. Okay, so now what is next? And okay, <laughs> the floor. Oh, look at that. We're on the deck. Very neat. Ooh. Oh my. Gosh, my legs! Oh my gosh, my other legs! Okay. Ooh. Ouch. Closed door? Okay, we're gonna run over there. Okay. Ah! <laughs> I am, I'm trying to stay low. There you go, he can't get me over here. Ah, my legs! Can I just, like, <laughs> run up over here, or...? Nah. Okay. We're doing okay. Uh, I've now got to do a quick getaway all the way to the other side. Ah! Uh, uh, uh. Ah! Okay. <laughs> it's 
that boat explosive? Is that what the- No, that's just a hilarious symbol. Hilarious, guys. Hilarious. Okay, who's chilling up on this rooftop? There's a laser. That... Oh, there it is. Hi there. I think they just want me to jump down on this wall. Ah. Okay, you can't see me down here. Is it just that one guy? No way is it just one guy, right? What is it with games in like, you know, 2009 to 2011 as well? And like taking place on a boat. You got this man, you got this. You got this. You got this. You'll get him. You'll get him next time. You'll get him. You'll get him. I said, no, seriously, you'll, you'll get him. You'll get him soon. His cold dead eyes. <laughs> oh, oh, it's, it's coming up to me. <laughs> Hold on, I'll disarm him. Oh, I can't disarm him. Can I slap him? Ooh, ooh, oh, 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 I can't disarm your leg. But you know what? I can't disarm this jump kick. Oh, my nuts. <laughs> ah. Okay. Okay. I, I get your point. I get your point. I get your point. No, no, no shooting. Oh. Ooh. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> I'm not really. Just gotta mix up my attacks. I'll never. He, f he predicts the jump every time. Ah, my face. There you go. Yoink! I'm, I'm gonna want your gun. I need your gun, bro. Oh, hey, hey! Come on! He's getting away. I assume he went down here because I don't recall this being open. No, dang it! They're so much easier to close than they are to open as well. I've never been on a boat where I've needed to actually like turn one of these valves. I think I've been on like replica ones where it's like they're on land. And they're just there to be like a like a history museum and they're like, close the door and they're like, hey, hey, when are you going to reload? You were shooting that fence like a hundred times. Hi, no, I'm chasing you there. Oh. I appreciate that he's showing you a good strat though. Steam. I say I say I hate Steam, but it's like, you know one thing that's actually amazing about this game? One, you can buy it on Steam. Nice. And two, it doesn't have any like additional DRMs. It actually is exclusively just Steam. Which is incredible because at the time they released it on uh I think it got a kinda later Steam release. I don't know if EA was doing stuff in 2009. But uh they had um Securom on the disc versions, and they had the EA. Okay, here we go. Take two on the fight. Um, and they had a would have would have been there. Yeah, it would have been EA Download Manager at the time before EA Play, and then it was Origin. Was it EA Play, or did they just jump straight into Origin? Can't do the second bunch. You always counter. Kick him in the nuts. I'm gonna need your gun, bro. Yeah, it kind of just ends abruptly. Intruder alert! Intruder alert! A red spy is in the base! Red! Ah! <laughs> oh. If only it wasn't for that cheeky little you know, thing. I don't know. Oh my gosh. No one stumbles through a submarine like that unless you're... Oh, you thought we wouldn't get a re reveal? <laughs> I tried to warn you off. I'm sorry. You've got to learn to let go, Fate. You remember? Like you did with your family. The runners are screwed. 
Icarus is just a start. And I want to live, Faith, not just survive. Oh, that's a callback to the cutscene from an hour ago. His campaign was getting unexpected support, but he got stupid. Unexpected he support? threats to the wrong people. High up people. He found out about Icarus. So they had you kill him. Him or me. Sorry about Kate. Didn't know she was your sis. I'm so glad there's explosive barrels everywhere just for occasions like this. Why have you got so much? Oh, I assume it's just oil. Does oil explode like this, or does it just like catch Don't fire? Ask, okay. Heard all I need to hear, kiddo. Listen, Creek says Kate's just been tried. Wow, already? Of the Swift Justice Program, huh? I d <laughs> they found her guilty, Faith. What? Of course they did. Convoy's taking her off to jail in less than an hour. She's going to jail. <laughs> You know, I'm actually impressed of a swift, <laughs> a swift uh, justice department, but uh, oh boy, it's daytime already. It was it daytime a moment ago? Okay, we're looking for a sniper rifle at some point in the level. We're gonna have to make do without my magical mammal. Back to the good old rooftop jumping. In. Oh, hi there. Hold on. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, you hit me in the back of the neck. Oh, he's hitting me in the back of the neck. I'm not enjoying that. I'm not enjoying that. I'm running. <laughs> we got away from him. It's all good. Don't worry. Uh... Can I just like kick him off when he like tries to like climb up here? He knows my strat. Oh, what? I'm jumping, bro. I'm jumping. There we go. go. What? Oh, I'm a little bit off to the side. It's okay. It's all good. They're too crazy to follow you down there. I was hoping they had like a runner symbol around here, but nope. No luck. No dice. Ah, you see what I did there. Oh. Did I say fire? Dude, that fire at, like, you remember, does, does anyone in, like, the Sydney area remember that one fire in, uh, like, right near Central Station? Um, was it at the end of last year? I think it was. Like, maybe about this time last year. That was a, like, nutty fire. And they found out it was just some, like, teens who were just like, oh, sorry. They, like, turned themselves in because they were worried it was going to get worse. And it's like, yeah, like, you know, probably the best outcome for them, but oh my goodness, like... What a bizarre thing to, like, happen, I guess. I don't know if the building was, like, under construction or just, like, wasn't in use, um, the top part. But, uh, no one got hurt, so... Not too bad. Oh, hold on, oh, hold on, hold on, I, I gotta climb, I gotta... <sighs> I was like, okay, I'm gonna climb a pole, which means the cops are gonna get in the way. So in that case, let's just give him the old one too. Is that a Mac? Is that a... Hey, you have returned just in time. I haven't gotten the sniper yet. <laughs> Good old CZ. I love it. There they are. I'm really curious. You should be able to just like kick him off. Oh, they disappeared. Never mind. Ooh. 
I remember this bit from Half-Life. I don't remember that part from Half-Life. <laughs> uh, some things never change, you know. Plus le champ, plus c'est le méchant. Uh, if if uh, someone's looking at the YouTube VOD, can someone tell me if the Whisper subtitles nailed that, or whether they just got it, like, so horrendously wrong? It's like, oh, he speaks English. Ugh, what's that? That's not English. Oh, come on. That's the one bit. Half-Life thing with a huge drop. Yeah. It's, it's right near the beginning of the game as well. Oh, yeah, Half-Life's the game that I can actually, like, nail in one stream. Like, I can actually do a sub-two-hour run of Half-Life. That one, I... Like, I think is my best, like, speedy run. Um, and potentially, uh, if I could do a little better, I could probably do a good, like, Metroid Prime 100%, like, including scans. In, like, oh my gosh. Um, like, 100% scans run in, like, I'm gonna say six hours if I know what I'm doing. I did it on, on stream, and I, like, famously, that was the... One of, uh, one of two streams I've done where I went past midnight local time. And it's 11.15 right now, so we could be on track. We could be on track for another past midnight stream. Oh my gosh, I'm... Is it, may, how do we, how do we make the stream go past midnight? Eh, easy. Um... I know I said I started the stream, like, feeling tired, but I'm actually, like, really into this. I'm really going. And I know we're, like, you know, closer to the end of the game. We know the plot twist, we know the villains at play. It's all about saving the day, bro. Okay. Take four. We run across a wall, and... <sighs> okay, there's a part of me that's now going, okay, is, is my... Like, is it the execution, or is it the uh, intent? This is programmer brain talking, I'll tell you. Um, but, so I'm like looking at that going, okay, there's clearly the ledge there. It's a bit of an awkward jump. The wall ride gives you the more distance. I feel like the intent is that you want to wall ride here and then you get like that landing. It looked a little awkward. I don't know if that's how you, that's quite the way it's meant to be done. I don't know how it worked. I'll accept it. I just had to like sit back and go, okay, yeah. City threat levels raised to red! <laughs> and the avian flu is still a thing. Drake says Krieg's just stashed the rifle. It's at the top of the atrium you're about to reach. The rifle, you say? Oh, I do remember this part. Yeah. This part is the ultimate test of your platforming, I tell ya. Because the last level's a bit more like, you know, your action climax. But like, this has like, all the bits. You know, you got your, your runs, your jumps, your uh, bit where you break your legs again. Oh, it's definitely not around this way. What a weird, like, this isn't even scaffolding, right? Or is it? Ooh, don't jump that way. Okay, well, wall run it is. It's all wall runs. That's the answer to everything in this game. Oh, look at those people out there. Having a normal day with their white cars because they can't afford the extra paint. But good on that guy for the yellow and black, you know, Umbrella Academy, you know, umbrella. It's not really a pun, it's just... Umbrella Academy? Wait, Umbrella Academy is a TV show, not... What's the Umbrella Corp from Resident Evil oh, Umbrella Academy? I don't know my TV shows. The only TV show I've really, like, actively watched is, uh, Fargo. I enjoy that one. Okay, well, this looks like it sticks out, which means... I see that. I'm just curious if this is the right angle. Well... Oh! What did I just... <laughs> yes! Yes, I got this. Don't worry. I got this. I got this. I, I, I could save it. <laughs> it 
It's probably easier from um, the other side. Because I was like doing a fairly long run to make that happen. <laughs> I have no idea what I grabbed onto though, I'll tell you. I could probably just do a jump from there, but okay. Okay, yeah. We'll do a, we'll do a jump from the concrete. That probably makes more sense. Ooh. Or I could just not jump. I'm changing my strat every time, so just just say no practice. No practice. We're just we're just winging. We're just going. There's probably a lot of occasions as well where it's like instead of like doing the balance beam, you just you just jump. You just jump it. Oh, I landed on something. Unfortunately, I'm now down here and I have to do it uh, the way I was thinking I had to do it. Oh, like that. But it doesn't quite... Oh, okay. <laughs> okay. And then, you know, the huge. The huge. Oh, the huge. We're good. We're good. We're up here. Okay, so now... Proper wall run. There we go. Again, I'll still say I'm enjoying this quite a fair bit. They should make a sequel out of this. You know what's actually the saddest part about the Mirror's Edge sequel? I remember this so, so distinctly. Uh, it came out four days before the EA, oh, before the EA uh, E3 conference in 2016. And they didn't mention it was out. They really didn't market that there was a sequel. Um, okay, can I, can I, can I turn around or nah? I guess we just, we just jump, might as well jump. Um, and I think that's probably like part of why it didn't really do too hot in the sails. Uh, this is, uh, I can make this work. There we go. Venting. No, 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 we're going in the vent, not over the vent. <laughs> Easter egg time, here's the run now. Once you get the sniper, you can look out the window on the opposite side of the building with a build, big billboard. Shoot the nine white circles. You should shoot the middle circle. Aim for the dead center after you shot. Look at the road below. Okay. Oh, rat gaming. Do I follow where the rat was or where the rat is? I'll follow where the rat was. It's probably implying that there's a good old-fashioned... Good old-fashioned... Nope. Where the rat was. Where the rat is. Follow the rat. <sighs> I should have known to follow the rat. Where did he go? Because that... That's a tight squeeze out of the vent. The rat shares its secrets. <laughs> The rats are cute. Rats are cool. There's a lot of cute little animals. Actually, I'm a big fan of like the big ones. Big rats are always great. Here we go. Oh, the ultimate of balance beams. Whoa, whoa, whoa. We're good. Oh, my legs. He's just a ghost. He disappeared. You see the rifle? Get to it. Get that convoy in your sights. Alright. Before I grab that, nine circles. What are we looking for? A billboard with nine circles. Connor's convoy. What's your status? Over. Oh, there you go. Center of the nine circles. One, maybe. Two, maybe. Three, maybe. I took, I took too long. Oh, you just shoot in the middle. Oh, I thought you were saying shoot all, all uh, nine of them, just the middle, and look towards the street. I'm looking towards. Connor's convoy. What's your status? Over. Looking good. Did I miss it? Hold on. I'm, I'm completely blind. Right? Again? Oh, again.
Hold on. I know I'm missing the convoy, so we'll get another restart. Dead center. Am I just... Am I doing it right? I missed it, Mark. We'll take one more crack. Hold on, so I'm going to shoot the absolute dead center. Right there. That's a proper dead center. Do I have to shoot it multiple times, or... Am I doing it right? Don't say patch out of Steam version. Or I'm just inaccurate. Oh my gosh, the gun has disappeared from existence. Maybe after the convoy spawns? Alright, we'll wait until then. I missed it, Mark. Oh man, it'd be weird if it's patch. Oh, look how it bounces there. Okay. Try going for the engine. I'm gonna patch you into the CPF channel the convoy's using. Come on, there's no convoy. We're gonna make a difference. I don't know the convoy. Looking good. Route is clear. Alright, there's the convoy. I'm gonna shoot the target now. Dead center. Now what? Am I doing this right? Am I doing this? I, I don't know if I'm doing that right. That doesn't seem like anything's happening. You see the rifle? Get to it and get that convoy in your sight. Find a way of slowing it down. Try going for the engine. I'm gonna patch you into the CPF channel the convoy's using. Connors, convoy. What's I also don't know if I'm over? shooting quite the dead center, but I, it's a Looking big circle. Good. Route is clear. I assume you're looking up right now. That's exactly how it's done. Maybe... Maybe it doesn't like doing it on your first playthrough. That's a bit weird. Or maybe you have to get your collectibles first. Because this is a this is a fresh save. This is full fresh. Alright, well, we'll continue on. Uh, to all the people watching, uh, look up that easter egg and tell me... What I did wrong afterwards. Shoot the car first. Convoy. We'll shoot the car first. What's your status? Over. Looking good. Route is clear. Route is clear. Okay, here we go. We're gonna shoot the convoy. We just shoot for the driver, right? There we go. Whoa. Uh Oh, find a, find a way of slowing. Duh. Find a way to slow it down by. Okay, now I'm actually looking at this going, how do you slow it down? Like, we've got an overpass here, but obviously an overpass isn't gonna slow it down. Okay. Probably the tire is my second guess. <laughs> I don't know why I'm like, how do you slow it down? Uh, you literally just shoot the driver. They got bulletproof glass and it's blackout. Oh, these poor people, man. Alright, we'll go for the tire. We'll go for the tire. Dude, imagine being building 13-15. Actually, it's probably tons of places in the city like that. Okay, we shoot the tire. Well, that seems like a very tough angle. No, he just did his, like, speeding thing. Okay. Not that. Runner's sure. vision. Put what am I aiming down, for? Though. What am I aiming for here? Visualize. Visualize, Splendor. Right Visualize. Get, get that convoy in your sight. Find a way of slowing it down. Try going for the engine. I'm gonna patch you in. Try the going for the engine. Connor's convoy. What's your status? Over. 
Looking good. Route is clear. Uh Ow, like the bonnet. Are we just going for the bonnet? Oh, we're just going for the bonnet. Okay, and now we shoot the shoot the bit. It was worth it. It was worth it. We did it. We did it in the end. It was worth it. Shit, too late. It was worth are. constantly trying that again and again just to see that. He is risen. He has returned. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> okay, now my brain's like, okay, how do I play the wrestling game again? Where's your gun gone? Okay. Oh, no, 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 no. Gun of that. Ah, he slapped me in the face. Alright. <laughs> you can run with a, with a CZ, can't you? Does this have a sc no, it's no scope. You know what I like? Shooting without scopes. Such an old idea now. Oh boy. Ah, oh, my internet is cutting out. Hope you get this. Train, don't do it, train. We did get the rat gaming hours though. Oh. Oh. Well, I need to get this part. Yoink! A very long yoink. There you go. He was patient enough to let me wait. Ooh. Hold on, I'm running down the stairs. Yeah. Oh. There we go. We're just going on a, on a weapon roulette here. It's like, next guy, what's he got? What my legs under there? I assume there's pretty much no way to get through this without- Oh, there's, there may be a way. Give me them RPK. <laughs> this is directly out of Battlefield, ain't it? <laughs> so good. And now we just leave to the front door. You know. You know, why not? Ain't looking glass, the studio over. It's not Kate. even the studio over. Kate. <laughs> Babe? Don't overturn a truck if uh <laughs> I can't believe you've done all this. <laughs> they don't have seatbelts in the back there. It's like really unsafe for them. <laughs> Take this. It's Merc. He's a friend. He'll guide you away from here. I'll lead the blues away. Come and find you later. Okay. Turns out when you're public enemy number one, there's not really much much more that you can go for uh for. Oh no. His expensive electronics and his grey tower PC and his floppy disk player and his serial scuzzies VGA, oh no. Oh god. Mark. I couldn't stop them. They took Kate. I got some of the bastards, though. Where'd they go? 
I heard them mention the shard. The shard. Place. <coughs> You're telling me that the mayor ordered a hit against his political Shh. opponent? Let me get someone, a doctor. Ain't gonna happen, Faith. I'm sorry, Merc. I'm so sorry. No, no sorries. Just don't let them win. Rip Merc, yeah. He did what all good, <laughs> all good backup guys. He's the guy in the chair. Ugh. Watch, any minute now he'll turn red. <laughs> well, now we're on to the last level, the shard. I'm pretty sure this is the last level, is it not? We got a big building and a big goal. You know where this is going, so let's roll. Let's get in there. Rat gaming. Okay, <laughs> a run down that says, oh, where am I going? Let's see, we got this like power box here, probably wall run? Or a higher ledge? Ah. Very, very high ledge. Okay, so now I need to get up there by... There we go. There we go. That makes a bit more sense. Uh... Yeah, okay. Oh. There we go. Good job. <laughs> Good job. <laughs> oh... <laughs> that was uh that was just a very very tragic ending <laughs> oh look at that don't need no pole don't need no pole there we go first try it was never in question okay there's got to be another good ah there you go so maybe i can spot him oh i can spot him can i get him there we go. Is that 14? Can I make it 15? Can I say we got half of them? Well, not at the moment I can't, but if I get one more, then cool. And if I get all three, then... Oh, I guess I didn't get half. Well, I've just set up a gas fire behind me. Oh, wait a minute. I've set up a gas fire behind... <laughs> Little did I know that, uh, chemistry is not my strongest subject. Is this a chemistry thing or a physics thing? Don't worry, if I hide in the side, the fire won't get me. Here it comes. Woo! Very subtle. And breathing in smoke. Always the best thing. Okay, here we go. Those were clean shots, were they not? Hopefully. I'm sorry, Wesker, I had to do this. Ooh. I'm in the line of that, that uh, gunfire a bit too long. Okay, I'm gonna need to yoink this. It's got a very shiny shirt. Is he just not even in this area? Like, okay. Here I am, I'm chasing ghosts. He's not even in here. Okay, we could go out the door. I got him. Oh, there's two of them. There's two of them. Ah. <laughs> there we go. We got this. <laughs> there's three of them. 
think we're good. I think I got him. Oh, no. Oh, really? Ah, PK, my beloved. Now I think we're good. Because really, I just need to go here. Boop. Van hijacked. Did I steal the whole van? Brutally. Oh, I guess hijacking is just sort of, you know, changing its trajectory. This lovely red chair out in the middle of nowhere. Oh! Hey, three against one. Not fair. And he's still got his dual pistols. What, what am I going to have? Oh! going to shoot me too? Right now, your pig's best hope. Weren't these your guys? No, they're PKs. Perindella crew. Private security. What's going on, Miller? You could, you could have just told them what was going on. They might have had families. Yes, you were right about him. I tried to get answers myself. But why Kate? They needed a CPF cop to look like Pope's killer. No time to explain more. Take this comms unit and head for the roof. <laughs> well, there's a bit of stereo audio going on there. when it's safe. I'll hold them off. The roof. Go. Now. Look at this guy being a bit of a double agent in your story. Okay, let's roll. Hi, I'm gonna need your gun, thanks. Yoink. Wonderful flip. So these guys are private security, so it's perfectly okay to... You know, this. Okay, we're gonna need a... We're gonna need to get the heck out of Dodge here. You don't need to kill them, I guess. Just need to get to the other side of the hole. Okay, maybe you do need to kill them. Whoop! <laughs> The other side. <laughs> easy. Easy. <laughs> I don't care that I just turned to Swiss cheese on the way. Easy. <laughs> the Shard sounds like a very lovely but slightly insidious name for a building, which is probably the point, but. I was on the ground floor there, by the way. <laughs> Pretty long ride, ain't it? Drop any weapons you have, stay where you are, and prepare to be taken into custody. Okay. Faith, are you reading me? I'm in the security room. All right, here we go. Get out of the elevator, they're coming. I do like a good elevator shaft, or lift shaft, or whatever. Do we call them lift shafts, or we still call them elevator shafts? There's still something no kind of spooky. No sign of her! Oh, we're good. Oh, oh, we're good, we're good. Whoa. Still, it's very neat. And again, again, uh, as, a, as a bit of an overall vibe, I've never felt like you really get stuck. It's like you find somewhere new to go. That's your strat. We've rarely had any shimmying like this, though, in the whole game. Like, sw I swear, did we actually have any instances of this other than the tutorial? Because you've never had, like, a moment of respite, really, for this. Uh, okay, why can I grab two pipes here? What am I... Oh, what, what am I... Oh, oh, that makes sense. Okay, there we go. 
Alright, here we go. Have I mastered the swing? I probably have. Okay. Oh, can I just wall ride this? Can we just... Nope, not quite. Looks like I'm gonna have to jump. Oh, oh. I've fallen. I can't seem to get up. Okay, take two. Take two. Alright, turn around. Nope. Oh, come on. That, that, cut. Oh. It's because there's a gap on, like, both the left and right there, where I'm, like, on the, on the one being, oh, bit too high of a jump. It's the last level, come on, I can, I can, oh, I can die a bit on the last level, can I not? Okay. I'm really struggling on this one, aren't I? There you go. Okay, and now I'm on this bar, which means we're good to just, like, do one of these swings at the end. There we go. We'll just get out like this. Thank you, music ramping up. We know what this is building up into. Ah. <laughs> Left or right. The choices are all the same. The illusion of choice. Oh, can I do a wall jump up here, really? Where is November? I was too young to remember exactly how it started. The authorities said the changes were for the greater good. But good isn't the same as right. Ah. Bit of, <laughs> bit of plot. Bit of plot. Just leaking out here. Uh, okay. So, in that case, uh, well, I dropped in from here. Do we just kick my way through here or climb up? Climb up. There we go. Okay. We're almost our way out. Here we go. I see you now. There's a sniper team guarding this area. You can get back in on the other side. Be careful, Faith. I do love the aesthetic of the nighttime, even if it's only used in this one final section of the game, really. You gotta dodge these bright lights. Whoop. Which was made much easier by me just botching up. Oh. <laughs> it's made much easier by me botching up my jumps. Can't you just like run along here and then like do a really like solid jump? Some speedrunner probably could. I'm not some speedrunner. I'm I'm just a regular guy who hasn't played this game in forever. But yeah, coming back to it, I'm like, yeah, you know what? This is a good time. This is a good fun experience. Still a bit painful. There's a couple of like weird little like tickling, you know, spots. And maybe maybe there's gonna be some parts of the game that are just like mm, a little bit like more annoying than maybe it should be. But you know, the idea is unique enough. I don't really think there's a lot of games that like have the same kind of feeling or sort of design. Oh, you missed. You missed, fool. You want to try? Ah. Oh. oh. He's pushed me off. I'm trying to counter him. Oh. We'll take another crack at it. I'm, I'm getting this timing right. It's it's just the moment it moves to the side. There we go. First try. Can we get the rest of them? Sending reinforcements. Excuse me. Oh, never mind. Okay. They're actually sending dudes to come up behind me. Who are these guys? Private military contractor or something? Who needs a staircase when you can just walk it? Right, here comes. Oh my. Dude, as if. As if I'm gonna... Wow, really? I'm able to just... Walk over... Okay. Oh. 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 <laughs> Bro, he died as well! 
What? No, you can't do that to me, can you? No. I'm building momentum. Alright, here we go. That was, that was not at all a side jump. I think my problem was I didn't hit that guy while I had the chance. There we go. We got the we got the disarm right away. Bonk. Let's see if we can get both of them. They're sending reinforcements. Let's try and get the other guy as well. Can I get him? Do I have the angle to get him? There you go. That'll save me so much like headache later on. And I'm up here already, so it's easy. Uh, that wasn't another guy that spawned right behind him, right? I just saw. No, that's just the explosive barrel. But I do need to be there, because, uh, the fence. Electric. Gotta watch out, electric fence. Don't hit the explosive barrel where I'm right next to it, please. Good, we're good. Okay, <laughs> we're good. <laughs> Vote. Callahan? You're telling me this is all about politics? I've managed to unlock it. Take it to the server room. You should be able to get to the top floors and Kate from there. Why are they keeping her at the server room? You're gonna input all my database entries, and you're gonna like it. <laughs> I'm still gonna like it. Oh, I guess I should be looking outside. Check this out. Woo! It looks like the security doors to the roof are closed. Okay. If you destroy those servers, their emergency protocol should automatically unlock the doors. I hope. Makes sense. Good luck, Faith. Look around. Surveillance for the whole city right under your nose, Faith. Damn. Sounds like they've taken Kate to the roof. They've got a chopper coming in. You'll have to be quick. What the oh no, they may have gotten them. Also, also are those flashbangs? Oh. We're not, we're not, we're not disarming well. There we go. Try and get his mate first. Okay. Hold on, can I snipe him from here? No, because I'm hitting the, hitting the column next to him. Oh, that's fun. Oh. I I regret everything. <laughs> oh, I know I know that surveillance is, is under my whole nose. I should I I feel like I've I've never been in a building that has giant sirens saying core integrity failure, although this is like for data, right? This is re restore from your ZFS backup, bro. You're doing snapshots, right? You should be doing snapshots. What are you doing? Alright. Nah. Nope. I am- I am not the- I am not a disarming kind of guy. I'm looking around, bro. Alright, let's get to the other side of the room. How about that? Or I'll use my disarm on this guy because he's got an RPK. Well, oh, that's just... No, that's just a regular M4, ain't it? Oh, he's built. And it's the most vulnerable spot, this one guy. Maybe the secret is you just run around until every single piece of electronic is just like shot at. Maybe that's the secret. You don't have to do the work yourself. Just 
just some stray bullets, you know? Destroy every single server in the room somehow. How fast am I? All the core banks have failed. That's got to be a good thing, right? And then I lost all my health in like one one breath. Ugh. Oh. I'm not having easy times with this gang. Seems a bit gutsy to go after two guys on the top ledge there. This guy seems like the easiest lad to go after. Yoink your gun. Steal your gun. I'm really not I'm really not having a good time here, aren't I? Okay. So I mean the plan is you just have to get every machine destroyed, right? Maybe I should like hang around the banks and just, you know, watch that these four all blow up in some variety. So it's like, oh look, I'm standing here. Have a shot at me. Here I am. There goes that one. Punch it. Okay, well my str my strat is still not working. Let's go right side this time. But I think yeah, I think the goal here is you destroy all the or you just damage all of these in some way. So let's group them up because I'm not I'm not doing my best here. Okay, now let's run to the other side. I feel like I can round robin them, and as long as I'm not like just getting caught out, then I'm okay. Plus, I keep kind of blind firing into this area, so... There's a bunch of people still stuck on the catwalk there. No, you nincompoops, you're destroying all of my big machines! Okay, there's a guy chilling there. That's bad news bears. We've got one guy who's leaking out over here. I might... This might be the guy who I'll need to disarm. Hi. You've just gone the wrong way for me needing to disarm you. Okay, well, we'll just leave. We'll just leave. I'll just, I'm not hanging out with you anymore. You don't play nice. Woo! Okay, you're gonna need to shoot these, like, back servers, because you're clearly not, like... Putting in the time to do it. That's not like a gun lying around that I could use, right? No. That would have been a bit convenient, wouldn't it? Nah, Catwalk is still like suicide, ain't it? But just these servers, man. Just like shoot here. Right here. You're, you're, you're almost about to hit them, but you don't. Well, it helps when you can disarm them, can't you? The worst part is, is that, like... Dude, imagine playing on, like, hard, because it's just, like... No chance with these fellas, I tell ya. Alright, this guy seems like the most straightforward to get his gun, and then he's out of the picture. And I'm, I guess I'm just gonna go around and use this to, like, shoot all the servers. Ah! 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 Bad! Don't do that. That's illegal. Okay, okay. And we make a run. We just run around a bit, catch my breath, and then we rinse and repeat, right? You really want me to do a jump there as well. Okay. Is 
It's not really made for shooting these servers, is it? Maybe you are secretly just meant to like run around aimlessly. Or you take out the guys. One of the two. I haven't quite figured it out yet, but... Hey, you know. One lead to the other. Okay. Guy down the bottom, two guys at the top. They're both gonna get me if I'm not running. Oh. Oh. I'm sort of just running around in circles here, like, I mean, it almost looks like you could break outside, but nope, not quite. So, okay, we need to, we need to somehow get someone to be, like, away from their group. There you go, perfect. Right here. Whoa, there's two of them. Are they respawning? I could, like, drop kick them, though, I swear. Alright, I just need to be in this, like, midway part. Never mind, I apparently just can't punch him. This objective as well says, like, you know, reach the server room and destroy the, the server, so, obviously, I need a gun, right? I mean, they shoot the servers, so I can visibly see that. Am I doing something incredibly wrong, or... Uh, shout out, by the way, we are past midnight. We are officially past midnight again. Because this doesn't, this doesn't get you very far in destroying the servers on their own, unless you can keep stealing guns off people. Excuse me, what was that as well? A massive, massive, like, counter opportunity right there. I just, ah, oh, I'm not doing this right. I'm not. Okay, now I'm getting a bit upset because I'm like, come on. I was, I was trying to jump at that. But I know, I guess I'm just doing it wrong somehow. All right, come on. This guy right here. Alright, use the guns, let's take out at least a couple of the other guys with guns, because... Or I could just get taken out myself. I need to- okay, my plan is, here's my plan, because I need to vis verbally say what I'm attempting to do. There's a bunch of servers here, but they don't take- they don't get taken out by gunfire very easily. So my plan is, let's try and take out the guys. Fighting them in fistfights is not really very easy, but if I had a gun, I could at least take out a couple of them in a much, much easier light, I guess. So like this, where I come up to him, I can then take his gun out, and he's also incapacitated. I'm now able to then take a, you know, breathe in a bit of the wall and then shoot this guy and the guy behind him, and maybe the guy behind him a little bit. But okay, gun's gone, but at least I've taken out three guys now. So okay, now we've still got the guy up there, and there's gonna be a guy maybe around to my right. He's still running around? I'm not too sure. But my goal is, if I can somehow get back onto the top, or alternatively just steal his gun. Ooh. But it's it's because I take basically like two bad hits. If I take one bad hit, I can sort of skedaddle maybe. But if I take two bad hits, no, nah, I'm out.
I need to, oh, I need to figure it out. I need to. Okay, I've got a gun. Centralize. Centralize, guys. Centralize. Okay. I don't suppose it's a uh, prime to get this. Okay, well, I picked up a different gun, but sure. Okay. Give me another guy. Hide it. Maybe the goal is instead of like blind firing, we shoot at. I don't know. Is there like a a, a, a sweet spot? You know what? Actually, I think I've realized it. Some of the machines are lighting up red, and those are the ones where it's easy to shoot. And it keeps switching between which cluster is that one. Or that's it. Or that's literally it. And I'm just an idiot. I might have just been an idiot. I think I might have just been an idiot. That might have been it. Because I'm looking around going, well, they're all off, right? And the stairs open up. I'm an idiot. I was just an idiot the whole time. And the worst part is I was there. There was a point in time when I was running around and it was all, it was all done. Oh well. Well, we're nearly there. I guess. Video surveillance? Oh my gosh, this whole game's about surveillance states. <laughs> well, the, the sign says keep out, I can't go in. Achtung, you know? That was... I mean, it looks like it's feeding me this way. Makes sense. Hold on. <laughs> My tired brain is just going like, Ugh. Yeah, what? I mean, this clearly looks like a dead end. But like, why am I, why am I wandering up here? What is up here that I'm just like, completely missing the point of? This is a very long monster closet, if it is. And this is clearly the next section, because it's walled me off. What on earth? I'm... Dude, my tired brain, I tell ya. There's a giant, brightly bloom-lit piece of toilet paper. And then... Okay. Progress somewhere. We gotta make progress. Pipes. Looks dark. There you go. There you go. Oop. No? No? Uh. Have I done something very, very wrong or. What? What is... I mean, it really does look like there's like a... Oh. Can, I, can I like kill... There we go. I'm just gonna kill myself. We'll just see what, what happens. The music's still going. Did I like sequence break? Did I like soft... Soft break? Was there something going wrong there or... No, we're back in this room, and it doesn't look like there's anything weird, including what's going on here. I just have the music playing. Oh, now I can jump the fence. I'm an idiot. I tell you, I'm just an idiot now. The worst part is we're right here at the end of the game. I would have been, like, so upset if that was something real serious. Hi there. Oh, it was him all along. Attitudes like that, that's exactly why I could. 
who's behind this? Let's just say I know who the bigger fish are. Callahan. Why us? You're no threat. Classic warfare. Break the lines of communication. Shoot the messengers. Without hope. And without the runners. Your clients. Those who just won't let go of the old city will be cut off. Older. And this city can clean up the last of it. Dregs. Dregs. So this is just the start. I prefer to think of it as an end. Still, you did a remarkably good job of coaxing out all those loose ends surrounding Pope's demise. It's why you're still alive. This guy's trying his best with one gun here. You can't live on the edge all your life, fate. Sooner or later, you have to jump. Oh. Oh, hi there. Looks like I'm gonna have to jump. Whoops. That could, that could have gone a little smoother. I jumped. Ah. <laughs> oh. Man, she's really not having a good day, is she? Oh. Whoops. And there you go. We got the big explosion. We saved the sister. The music isn't stopping, is it? I've unfortunately played the ending with the music constantly blaring still. We got a song at the end. Well, <laughs> that's it though. Uh, I, I apologize so deeply for how terribly I've probably played this game. But on the flip side, I guess I did it in a single run, so... Is that a pun? That's not really a pun. Uh, all this private security doesn't care anymore when the helicopter blows up. It's all over at that point. But yeah, that's, that's Mirror's Edge. Uh, one of my thoughts, it's good fun. I definitely, there's parts of it where it's like, mm, does it convey itself the best? I don't know, here and there, but uh, certainly it, uh, you know, it's such a fun, unique experience. There's certainly a lot to this game that's like, you know, especially, I, you know, like it's, it's a game for the speedrunners in the sense of like, there's lots and lots of different options that you can do in this game. It plays out so nicely, and my mouse is just chilling right there. Hi, mouse. Hey, there's all the Swedish names. But yeah, no, it's it's great. Uh, again, I do not know anything about the sequel at all, other than it's open world, and that people sort of you know have a bit more of a mixed reaction to it, and uh, it didn't really sell well, anyways. Um, but like, I think this game was it was very iconic for the Xbox 360 generation. And I think it's emblematic of maybe a lot of things about it. Perhaps, you know, forgiveness on the uh, on the difficulty. It can get a bit hard, but it's also like, well, the checkpoints are pretty, pretty forgiving. Um, it's got that, it's definitely got that modern, you know, I guess shooter structure in the sense of, you know, you've got your chapters, you've got some set piece moments, you've got some cutscenes, and then it kind of ends in a little bit of a, you know, not the biggest climax. Oh, I mean, it's a story climax, sure. But it's sort of like, <laughs> the hardest part was me figuring out that server bit at the end there. Definitely, it got harder, but the very, very last thing you did was a quick time event, basically. Um, so, I think it's emblematic of that, but I think also, it's an interesting era that maybe at the time some people were critical of that we can look back and go, yeah? It was a bit more alright, in ways. NVIDIA, please hire me. Also, is the end song of this game also called Still Alive? Hmm. Got some EA Shanghai in there. Does that count as outsourcing? Just, it's another EA studio. Nowadays, it's like every EA studio is on deck on making the same project, and then it's just kind of a Blair game that needs to be constantly updated because 
that's what's in the terms and conditions, basically, for the, well, not the like, that's, that's the contract that the devs basically sign up for, it's like, you're gonna keep supporting this game forever. Only nine people died. So classic still on the run. Including the role of the so-called runners in the destabilization of city operations. In the aftermath of the incident, local security firm Pirandello Kruger will be assisting the CPF. PK and the mayor's office have also recommended mobile phone and email be used sparingly until additional security measures have been deployed, as their security has been temporarily compromised. The whereabouts of both suspects are currently unknown. You think it's interesting that the, uh, the mayor is just nowhere seen this entire game? This is sort of, I guess, a hint at like, oh, you know, we're doing this for a sequel, maybe you can imply on that, but I'm sort of thinking, like, this game really does stand on its own and doesn't really lean into a sequel in terms of story. I think it's more just like, oh, there would be so many more things you can do in the game than just what was here, because this really was, like, everything in that tutorial was everything that showed up in the game, basically. Just make the levels a bit more convoluted and add more enemies. That's how you do it. And it's actually fine as well, for a game that's this short. Like, you know, this is a nearly four-hour stream, but we're not going to hit four hours. And I'm like, oh yeah, modern game credits. We're only now getting to the QA. I'm gonna sit through this, man. I wanna, I wanna get all these people in here. Oh my gosh, EA Black Box, we're in here. Is that EA Black Box? Over these fellas, maybe. And the Romanians. Heck yeah. And the music's a vibe. I think it holds up. It holds up really, really nicely. I'd probably... <laughs> Top 10 2009. I don't know. I don't, I, don't, I don't know my 2009 games to really say which one is best or, or worse or whatever. Um, but I guess, yeah. For, for me as well, I guess... This was one of those, like, early Steam picks. Where it's like, you know, when, once I was like, oh, you know, do I use... Like, well, I don't, I don't know. I, I, I skipped buying an Xbox 360 and a PS3 and I went sort of straight into doing more PC gaming around 2011 onwards. And this was one of those games that was just like, oh, you know, like, it's PC gaming's great. You get to play this game in, like, you know, a great resolution and it runs great. And because this was on my GTX 580 at the time, which uh, would have crushed this game fairly well, so. Do you know any of these? I think everyone knows, like, Speaks and Physics and Zedlib. And OGG. OGG Vorbis. My family? I guess it is first person. The Thai House Walk. Is <laughs> Bacon and Pesto. It's probably names of pets. That's some good names for pets. But yeah, what is there left to do in this game? Uh, for me, streaming? Not really anything. For you, playing this game, you can play any chapter of the game you want. And uh, find the bags, as well as also do a speedrun if you want. Uh, you can also race people online on the leaderboards that don't exist. Um, and uh, other than that, that's kind of it. And you can unlock, uh, you know, concept arts, which is cool. I've probably not unlocked all the concept arts. But it is nice to be able to have, you know, this concept art and, and, uh, that kind of stuff. Actually, how much concept art do I have? I probably got all of it. Oh my gosh. Maybe we did unlock the whole thing. Oh my gosh, E3 trailer music. Heck yeah. Well, with that, I would like to thank you all so very much for watching and for sticking with me through this, but, uh, we got there in the end, so if you enjoyed this, uh, or you didn't enjoy this, who cares? You can still follow anyways, it doesn't really matter. You can follow on Twitch, I'll stream again at 8.30pm Australian Eastern Standard Time. Uh, maybe the streams won't go on this long, I wanted to nail out a really long one. 
Um, if you uh, miss parts of this and you want to watch it back later, um, stream VODs disappear from Twitch within a week because yay, uh, but the stream VOD will be on YouTube very, very soon, unless you're on YouTube, in which case, please subscribe because then you get told about more VODs. Uh, I don't really do this for the numbers game though, so just, you know, do it because you like it. Do it because you like the engagement. Something like that, so yeah. Uh, and if you want to see silly things I say, you can follow me at Pleroma. I'm on, I'm, I just go to m.bnl.com. You'll find my Pleroma there, so. And it's in the description and stuff, you'll find it there, so. Uh, but yeah, with that, take care, don't stay up too late like I did, and uh, eat your greens. Or your reds. Eat your reds. This game's all about red. My eyes are red, I'm just <laughs> tired as well. <laughs> Alright, good night everyone, see ya.